Yeah. And that's why I said I already can't put him above guys like Kobe because Clay Bryant would have wanted that six seed. I know that for a fact. I keep telling folks LeBron ain't. I told
pretty cool thing. So uh, I rode on my shoes tonight. I think I put uh, I think I put Mamba f uh, for life, eight twenty four uh, KB, because um, it's really it's really that it's really that mutual. So. Who was the guy that brought chills up and down your spine when he came onto the floor? The greatest player you ever saw. That would have to be the goal. Dude, this is crazy. <coughs> God damn. My bad. Well, Mike, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Can I go ahead and do My the bad. introduction? Can I do the introduction for you? 
Yeah, go ahead. All right. Now, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to uh, once again Go My Channel. And uh, y'all need to hit that like button, subscribe, and send those donations. Go Mike has a big announcement to make tonight, and all y'all need to be tuned in to hear this. This will be bigger than the OJ Simpson case. And if y'all don't tune in, you will miss out. It's me, LaFonso. I need Texas. I need Infamous. I need Grinch. I need ACP. I need a hammer. Oh, 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 oh. Watch me. Baby, y'all don't need to get your asses in here so y'all can hear what's going on. Real talk. Cam, get your ass in here. Everybody. Let's go. All right. So I'm going to start the breakdown. Now, what I'm about to tell y'all, man, it's not easy to say. But I got a CSM who's the front end manager at my Walmart, right? Right. So this lady, for one, she stayed trying to talk to me. But the reason why the reason why she 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 transferred to my Walmart four days ago. And wait, 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 wait she, go by. Say it again. She transferred to your Walmart four days ago. No, 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 no. I, I actually said it backwards. She got transferred from another from one Walmart to my Walmart. Okay, 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 okay. Because because the one at our Walmart they they they, they fired our front end they fired the front end manager and then they transferred another one from another store. Okay, okay. But this manager, uh, four days straight she's tried to talk to me and I'm blatantly ignoring her. Now do it now. Does anybody does anybody want to guess why I'm blatantly ignoring her? It's a, it, it's a, it's at least a couple of reasons. Because uh, you want to bang her. No, that's actually way off. Okay. Uh, Cause you, you don't like her then. Well, that's too, that's too obvious. The, the, the reason why, the reason why I don't like her is because one, I was a full-time worker working 40, 50, 60 hours a week. This bitch not only cut my hours down, but mm. she cut these bitches down to two days for a whole week. So I'm now getting 16 hours for oh. the whole week. So she came in and just changed everybody hours. She she put everybody at 16. Everybody who was getting good hours is now getting 16. And then on top of that, her mouth her mouth, I could tell you this, LaFazzo, if I wasn't raised right, I would have beat the, you know what? Does her mouth, need a, her mouth need a cream pie? Man, no. She don't She don't even deserve that. She deserves it straight up. At, but I'm telling you. Bro, I, ain't, I, ain't, 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 bro ain't, no, ain't no bitch coming to my work site and changing my hours. Hell nah. She didn't just, she didn't just change the hours. She talking like she a bad bitch. So she, wait, wait, she go is Mike. I see go this. Mike. Go Mike. Go ahead. She, go ahead. she put your hours at 16 hours a week? For the whole week. So so we get paid every two weeks, but 16 hours for each week. Mm. That's not good. Six, 16 weeks ain't nothing. Bro, you yeah, you be making chump change, man. But the but the that, here's the thing that, I'm saying. I, I wouldn't even consider that part time. Like that's nothing. I gotta I gotta get to the last bit of this piece. Thanks, Grinch. I gotta like, get like, to like the, part time. I'll, I'll consider like twenty twenty five. Y'all gotta let me. Just, y'all gotta let me at least continue. I, I have to at least continue breaking this shit down. Well, go this ahead. Chick, cause, cause right now she this front, you all. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. This front this front end manager, she she bad as in she got the body, she got the looks. But bro, behind that mask will look somebody. 
Bro, you talk about evil, you talk about disrespectful, talk about out of pocket, talk about uh no character, no personality. I'm Miss Big Bad Bitch. I could do this, I could do that. You do what I say, and this, this, that. Bro, I ain't gonna lie to you. Uh if y'all were if 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 I were in my younger days, I'm definitely going to jail. Because the way the way she talks after cutting people's hours, bro, bro if if I was a woman, uh, Lafonso or uh, Grinch, boy, I tell you, she don't deserve. She don't. She don't deserve hey, no. Hey, hey, she could be bad all she want. If she got no brains, man, it, it, like no discussion. But the way, but, but here's what I'm saying: the way she talks, she knows deep down. If you go outside the drive doing that shit, you get mighty watched. But go, Mike. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. This ain't making no sense because you just told me. <laughs> A couple of days ago, that you finna transfer anyway. No, another, here's the problem. Another, another store took you. They're not. Wait, no, I thought you said the girl transfer to your store. Well, here's the here's here's the well, problem. Well, I'm confused now, man. The transfer, the transfer was supposed to go through for me to transfer stores. You know, you know the problem with that is this oh, Mike, bitch. You said it already had happened, it, it, and you had transferred. And, and, and no, you let them no. change your hours, whenever and you, you didn't say nothing. Whenever you grant, That's crazy, grant, bro, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't say nothing. You should let them change your shit. Grant, grant, you didn't grant. rebuttal. You didn't do nothing. Grant, god damn. Grant just talking facts though. Go, Mike. Listen to him though. Here's, the, here's what I'm saying. Whenever you transfer, Lafonso, listen. When you transfer, it does right. not go through right away. You have to wait at least two weeks. That's how it works. In, that's how work. That's how it works in Walmart. They make you wait. Whenever you put a transfer paper in the transfer, you have to work at that same location for at least two more weeks before you can actually start at the other location. Mm, that's crazy. You know what I would do if I was you, go Mike. I walk into work with my dick hanging, saying "Fuck all y'all." I mean, God damn, bro. Hey, 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 hey Lafonso, ain't no way, ain't no way, and no hell, ain't yeah, no girl coming in and reducing my hours. Oh, That's let not me, let me, no. Six hours a week. Let me also say the last. Let me also say the last piece too. Whenever you put a transfer in, right, it got two weeks. It got two weeks to be approved. So if if the manager says, you know what, I want to fuck this person over and 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 deny that transfer. They can do that for any way from week one to week two. Okay, so can man look uh, uh Fonzo talk about this now? You got it out there? Go on, go ahead, go ahead. Hey Alfonso, and nigga, if that was me, fuck this job, my nigga. Right. Hey, you no know, 16 hours, man. What the fuck? The, 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 the uh, uh, it's not even that. The fact the fact that you have more loyalty there, you stay there for years, and, and they treat you like man, that. Here comes here, here comes a new bitch, and all of a sudden they reduce your average more, more by half. By half. That's a problem. That's a problem. Dude. Now, now, guess what? You're not even making the money that you was making then, but yet you have dedicated yourself to this company. See what I'm saying? I'm right. just saying, bro. I'm, I, there's, there's no because, way how they taking my hours, and I'm not saying nothing. Because, 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 listen to this. If you're working for a boss, and that boss know you're dedicating your hours, and you busting your ass, then you get a new boss. Guess what, bro? That's like starting over. Mm hmm Now, now you got a boss who's a female, bro. That's the worst boss to have. And secondly. She gonna reduce your hours down to sixteen something hours a week, man. You That's know what, nothing, nigga. nigga. I, I, hey, I'm gonna be honest with you. I will walk in and work one day with my dick hang out, saying "fuck y'all." They ain't shit, bro. I know little kids deliver newspapers make more than that. I ain't gonna cap to you. The way this bitch, the way this bitch be talking, <coughs> like I tell you, the father, woman. Bro, she wouldn't even talk to me. I'm telling you. I told my granny about it. My granny's 102 years old, and she wanted to beat her ass. What'd that tell you? 102 year old grandma wanted to beat your ass. That's how bad her mouth is. It's awful. The way she talk, 
She taught that big boy. That big. Uh, well, I'm calling her boy now, but I don't give a damn. But I'm just saying, uh, uh, Lafonso and Grinch. If she talking about that, she she she, 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 try, she she trying to put on man pants. But that's what I'm saying. If she talk like that on the street, bro, I'm telling you, she's not going home. Hell no. Talk, talk, talk down the street, you get your ass whooped, beat up, punched in the mouth. So wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. So, so, so. She's talking so, reckless. So, so she cut all y'all hours? All y'all employees? She cut everybody hours in, in the whole establishment. She poking her chest out, talking crazy to people. And she even she even talked crazy to people that, for example, half of the workers at my job, they're uh introvert. So what I mean by introvert, they they they're not very talkative to themselves kind of people. Yeah, but she even she even crap talked them. So now now not only do you cut everybody's hours, but you're crap talking anybody and everybody. You're poking your chest out. You demand stuff from people. Your way or the highway, all kind of shit. You're taking well, pictures well, of people. Wait 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 wait. You accept that after all the years you've been there? I didn't. I didn't accept it. I told her ass. I said, "Look, how, how do you let someone disrespect you like I that?" I told her, especially a female. I told her, I didn't. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. I didn't accept it because I told already. Already told her. I said, "Look, if I was a woman, you wouldn't. You wouldn't talk the way to me." Nah, bro. That's why I said if she was on the street, Grinch. Boy, I tell you, she getting mauled by man and female. She talking real reckless. She poking her chest out like you got fucking a man chest. Poking your fucking chest out. You talking fucking crazy. You got your head rolling. You mean mugging motherfuckers. Wait, so, she wait, wait, so, do you, so, so do you have an example when you say she's a mean mugger? Mean mugger, for example, you'll ask her a question and she'll and, and she will look at you like she want to beat your fucking ass. She'll have that kind of look on her face. Oh, she'll look at you like you crazy? Like you fucking stupid. <laughs> and crazy. I, I had those type of bosses before. <laughs> <laughs> I can relate. <laughs> Uh, and she talking to you crazy, bro. But but you are uh, transferring out of there though, right? No, she canceled the shit. She knows what? that I don't. She knows that because look, the transfer was supposed to go through, but she canceled the motherfucker. So so now she knows that I don't like her. So she wants to trap my ass with her at, at the store. That's a nightmare. So she basically, she basically trying, they try to force me to quit, pretty much. Dog, I, if I was you, I'm looking for new jobs. I am, but I'm, I'm not but dealing I'm not with that do. bullshit. Hell no. Nah. I'm, not, I'm, I'm, not, I'm looking for a new job while while I have a job. That's smart. And and so, what is she like? The the new manager there. She knew she knew front end manager. She's twenty one. You know, you know damn well they're not getting those those type of positions because of uh, experience. You know, they be getting it with other shit. Stop I, being I, dead I, I, this I, bitch I'm not is gonna go ready hard, but let's let's keep it a bug. This bitch, but here's what I'm saying, Grinch. This bitch is twenty one. She's the front end manager. Her mouth, that, Grinch. Yeah. Have you seen this lady? Grinch, you would quit the same day. Because the way she taught the people, bro, Grinch, I'm gonna lie, she's 21. I'm being dead ass. She's 21, she's the front end manager. Not joking. Yeah, she probably she probably slept with a couple of the bosses to, to get in that type of position, but she slept she bro, the way she looked, Grinch, right? I don't believe her getting this position had nothing to do with education. I believe it had, you know, I, I really can't say, but you know where I'm heading. No, oh, I know. Because when you look at this bitch, right, she's not ugly. She's bad as fuck. Got all, she got all the great stuff on the outside. She, she got all the bad. 
She did. She bad. You should, she got tears. You, you shouldn't care there. about that. You shouldn't care about that. That's what yeah, Sims talk I'm about when saying, she's. I'm a, not saying Grant. Uh, uh, damn, I called you Grant. Fuck, Texas. I'm not saying I care about it. What I'm saying, <laughs> Texas, is that is that I'm gonna have to find a new job because this bitch, she talked crazy to people. You poking your chest out. You talking reckless. You cut everybody hours to sixteen. You're talking bad to people, bro. She got she got a lot of staff that want to beat her ass, and, and 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 it's not just one person. It's a multitude. She got a lot of people that want that that that, that would if there were no cameras, they would catch her right right in her fucking car, because because the way she talks, uh, Texas. If you talk like that in the fucking hood, fuck fuck hood anywhere, niggas is niggas mowing your shit. Your ass is fried. Your ass is fried. Fuck the job at this point. She talked bad to be poking your chest out. Don't you work at Kroger too? She works at both jobs. No, I had you. She work at, I got to I got to work in it. I got to work in both ways, both fucking ways. No, she taking no. pictures of my ass. She taking pictures, but but you don't like me. You fucking talking crap, but you don't like me. bro. She talked the way she talked. Uh, Texas. If I was a woman, I would just man. I ain't I ain't I ain't gotta say it. If I was a woman, don't you work at Kroger as well? No, I'm just asking. I, I, or, work or, at, I work at Walmart and Kroger, but but mm -hmm. she works at both of them. That's a that's huge thing. I gotta mm -hmm, see her that, both ways. That's that, that. What are the chances of that? I, I don't. I don't know. The thing is, she works at both jobs. But the thing, Texas, the way she Texas, the way she looks, you could just tell she got she, she got the front end position off of looks, not off education, because. Texas. She's 21. She has all the curves. She has all the body. Uh, I, I get that. I get that. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not saying I care, Texas, but I'm saying the person that gave her the position, yeah, I know. Yeah. they must care because she's not smart at all. She has no intelligence whatsoever. She's 21. How you? The, the only way you can be 21 and be a front-end manager, a front-end manager Texas, is like just under store manager. To me, you should be at least 30 to uh, be in, you know, those kind of managers. Right. And you have to be mature at some level. This girl, when you hear her talk, Texas, she is immature at the highest level, but got that position. That's some bullshit. That's the way the world is headed, man. Just just look pretty as a female. You get the job. I, I, but I, 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 I think Texas can relate since he worked at restaurants. I mean, there be some young girls with, with them type of... Uh, <laughs> This bitch got no, 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 no. And you already no, know no, what's no. up. A twenty-one-year-old, no, I no. I don't like young women, brother. A twenty-one-year-old boss at a restaurant is different from a twenty-one-year-old boss at a retail job. The whole time out, wait, time out. There for for one, there's never a twenty-one-year-old boss at a restaurant. I'm right. giving, a, I'm, I'm giving, a, I'm giving an, an example. My, my boss is my boss is twenty-one, and she and, and she's the front manager at a grocery store. He trying to compare that to uh, a restaurant. You can't compare the two. No, I'm saying a manager, manager to manager. She's the front. This front of manager, Texas. I ain't gonna lie to you, Texas. She is. She is lucky that there's cameras in Walmart. Yeah, I've never worked for um, a female manager that was in her 20s. They were all 30s. Well, one, one was 29, but this yeah. bitch talks so bad, Texas. This, this, this bitch talks so bad. She makes your skin turn turn fucking black. Brother, just find I'm a new job, man. bro. Just find a new job. Grown men, just for your grown. That's yeah. What I'm doing. All right. Is there, is there is there actual subject that we're going to talk about, or, or, or if not, then I'll, I'll head out. Because I mean, I'm not going to be complaining about some 21 year old chick constantly, brother. Like just 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 move on from her. Go go ahead, Texas. No, I'm, I'm asking not, you. I don't really... Oh, Lafonso, where where Lafonso go? He was on here. So look, you know what? I'm gonna call him now because he might have been. I don't know. Grant, where you at, man? Because I'm not getting ready to have a complaint session about some kid, 21 year old. Nobody said we're having a complaint session. Yeah. That's what it was to me. That was like a five. That was like a five ten minute conversation, sir. That's still I've a session. Like, I've been, I've been live for 30 minutes. Uh, is that conversation only lasted 10 of those 30, 30 minutes? I don't know what you're talking about. Hello? Where, where you at? Yeah, you popped up with Texas pulled up. You popped up, you pulled in. All right. 
I'm on my way back. I'm just getting, going through the stuff to get back in. I'm, I'm going to get back in there. Trust me. I'm on the side. Okay. All right. All right, wait. Hey, wait, wait. Uh huh. Yeah, let, let me send an extra link for you. Okay. All right, come on. Man, Texas, I, always, I ain't gonna lie, Texas is funny, bro. You remind me of me, low key. That's what's crazy. That's pretty bad, then. No, no, no. Well, it's 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 not, it's not a bad thing, but you kind of do with the with the with the repetitive stuff. Or repetitive stuff. When you mention the same, you, you mention the sentiment like four four or five different times straight. But everybody everybody See, but does that. The the thing is, when I do it though. I don't say it like I just like this is my first time saying it. The reason why I say things more than once is because I want to hammer a point home. But I don't say it as though I'm just reintroducing like I'm introducing it to you like we just didn't hear it. If if because because when I speak, you'll notice I'll say like I said, you know, to that's what if you, if you go in any other place and they communicate like you, bro, you're hearing it in interviews. Whoever you like, Aaron Rodgers is a pretty good speaker. I'm not saying I am. I'm just saying as, as an athlete because you I know you like Aaron Rodgers in the past. He'll say the same thing. Anybody will say like, go no, go to a presentation somewhere. They're gonna you're gonna numerous times reiterate the same point to hammer a specific point home. Like if it if they think it's important, they're gonna double back around and say, as I stated previously, or you know, that's what I say. I don't just I don't just say it like I didn't like I never said it like you know. So right so so right now, Texas, you you're, you're trying to start a uh, a uh, live. Uh, you basically are you are you're articulating yourself at a very high level. I'm not saying that. No, it doesn't take. A, no, 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 no. I, no, all I'm saying, I'm just saying, most people in general, it's not, it's not that it's, it's not about high level speaking. I'm just saying, like a lot of if you listen, to a lot of people like who you know who are trying to hammer a point home, they, they'll re sometimes repeat something to emphasize what they're saying. So it can be etched in that person's mind or the point that you're trying to get across. But sometimes, but sometimes some people say things repeatedly like they didn't just say it, you know, but I don't know. Grant, where you at? Nigga, you just fell asleep? <sighs> I don't know. <laughs> like, man, y'all talking, talking about a bunch of bullshit. I'm waiting for, for something real. Uh, sir, the BS came before with you on the panel before I joined, brother. I just I literally came you here. You a were a bunch of bullshit, nigga. So sir, you say a bunch of BS every single time, bro. Make no modicum of sense. Rarely, <laughs> rarely, rarely you do. You're not nobody special, my nigga. The you fact that you have to say I'm not anybody you, special you means so blindly. Why get us? Okay, if you know that, why say it? The fact that you got to say it means that there's you're a not, kind of inferiority I'm complex. You're not, buddy. I want okay. you to know that. What's, what's, what, what's understood should not be stated. Then inferior people in their mind say that. Like you said. You see, I, I don't have to ever I'm, tell I'm, another I'm man he's not better than me because yeah, I don't have to tell another man he's not better than me if I if I know he's not. You apparently have to. Inferiority so complex day, makes nigga. you do that. My, my day's probably no, longer thank than your fucking arms, mm, nigga. Yeah. All right. Now you're getting such the old Grinch, huh? Not as me what? being real. People with inferiority complex. Fucking forehead. Here we Okay. Yeah. Fucking I bet. Fuck, I bet you had some experiences before, haven't you? You know all about it. Tell me. T t tell uh, your boy Doors about it. Oh. Inferiority oh. complex based men like you have to tell somebody you're not better than me, bro. If that means that I feel inferior to somebody if, if I have to tell you that. Mike, Mike, no, pay attention. No, I, I, I yes, like yes, yes. But there was no reason to say that. There's no reason to say that unless you felt that in your heart, in your soul, in your no. spirit. The depths in your crevices in your spirit. I, yes. I just want you to know that. I, I, I just want you. If you know boxing, have you if you know boxing, have you ever heard a boxer say, uh, you're not better than me? Brother, the fact that you got to say he's not better than you is subliminally telling you that you believe he's better than you. You don't even know that. Yeah, I forgot you're twenty. I, I forgot you're twenty one. You get you got similar like on your breath. You're getting brother. emotional, brother. You started cursing, oh bro. Oh my god, do you want to cry? 
I guess you're on your period tonight, brother. You little bitch. Like, why you, you gotta be so sensitive? <laughs> brother, you're the one that started by saying someone's not better than you. That's somebody that sounds like they were hurt for some reason, you, brother. You, you say you say I say stupid stuff hey, all the time. Hey, so clean up the perfect? blood, bro, because you're on your menstrual cycle. It's kind of leaking through your underwear, bro. Clean are, it up, are bro. Are you perfect? Who said I was? Nah, I, I love fucking around out here. You know, so. uh, oh, oh, you like, oh, oh you, and, and you do, and you do that with men too, don't you? See, see, see you take, you take, yeah. Care of those, so yeah, that, that hey. just shows your level of immaturity, brother. Because, I, brother, you know what's funny though? I don't care what you think though. So I'm not gonna argue. You obviously care because you keep talking about it. Like, no, you you care, you care about me. You care about me because you have the need to say other man's not better than you. But you feel you feel inferior. That means you care, brother. You're on the panel. <laughs> you feel inferior to me, and then if you have to say that. That's not my fault. I'm polarizing, bro. You I feel know. inferior? Oh, that's okay. No, you bro. feel inferior. How you feel? If you understand English, if, well, if you I, I forgot. Me, Spanish is probably your number one uh, lingo, if, right? If, I forgot. If you think you're inferior to me, that's cool, bro. I, 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 think I never said that. If you think you're inferior to me, that's cool. That's what that's what you said without saying it. That's you're inferior cool, to me. If you're you inferior to me, I know that. That's cool. Hey, take your camera off. Now you the one. You, you feel inferior to me, sir, because because you, otherwise you wouldn't say what you say. Turn the yeah, phone. Turn the camera off. We can't see you though, bro. But turn the camera off. I Who, can't. Who's that? I can't see it. Hey, put him in backstage, Mike, until he gets on. Yeah, I'm gonna add you to the back to get your camera. But Grinch, I already know when I when I come on here, there's no credible conversation with you. So I, I'm prepared for the BS every now and then. That's fine. You like that person where they bring uh, where there's a gathering of food and they and they know that what you bring doesn't amount to much, so they don't even ask you for anything to bring. <laughs> and that's how I, that's how I attribute you to this conversation. <laughs> yeah, buddy. It's okay, right, little buddy. buddy. It's alright, little buddy. Sorry, right, little buddy. I, I see your um You funny though, I'll give you that. You funny. I see your I see your pressopography matches your age. Learn that word. I just never had to tell a man ever in my life that he's not better than me. Because if I have to say that, that means that I deep down think that he's better than me. Nope, you just not better than me, buddy. Don't care to be. You obviously care because you keep mentioning it, buddy. No, 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 I'm telling people who are listening, bro. You, you, 26 year old, caring about a 21. I'm, I'm, so, I'm not 26. Cause that, how old are you? 25, 24. We're not far in age. You, 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 you're you, you, older you, than me, and you give a fuck about me. I know. Like, I don't ever mention your name ever when you, uh, when, when you're not on here, right, <laughs> brother. Oh, brother. Wait, you want to see the camera button? Alfonso, no offense, bro. If you went missing, then I mean, I would pray for you, but I, I, I'd move on. And you bring up age like that, Matt. Like age, we're only a few years apart, bro. Not, I'm not 35. So, brother, you I don't call you 35? <laughs> no, no, no. I'm, I'm giving you an example, brother. You, you should. I, I called you what? 25? That's, that's not. That's You're not gonna be 22. Years. I wasn't that far off. No, actually, actually, and you're gonna be 22. Yeah. So. Yeah. No, when you mention age, it's like, oh, you're saying like it's just a big gap. No. Nah. Now, if I were 35, then you like, you got to text them. That's what I thought. I just text them. <sighs> I could bring them back in, but, you know, I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want I don't want his camera to be on, though. Who, who, who was that, LaFonso? Yeah, LaFonso on the back. I got him in the back seat because the camera. Hey, Grinch, are you? Never mind. I'm not gonna do that to you. Uh, man, I'm gonna, man, I'm gonna call. I was gonna say, I was gonna say some. Oof. I, I, I got, I got a nuts, buddy. Go ahead and ask. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna say that because uh, that would be uh, against my code. Because I'm, I'm not trying to, you know, really be in social with anymore. <laughs> I'm I'm giving you a pass. I just said I, I got no 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 I got nuts, nigga. no no I'm I'm saying no no I'm saying my why, code why, why, like why am I gonna feel pressed about something if you want to say something say it no no I'm saying my code brother because I don't want to say insult you with stuff because I'm I don't do that anymore yeah because I could because because I because I, I would be held accountable dang I don't know what to do Texas he's in the back but his camera ain't working put tell him to put some tape on it. 
Wasn't Tay Vaughn at the Elefanto? I don't know. Hey, hey. Oh, well, man. I don't know what's going on. I don't know, man. All I was, right. I was, I'm, I was, no, nah, well, if, it's, if, it's, if he's showing, then, okay, it's black, all right. You can't even see his dark ass. I'm about to, I'm about to add me on. <laughs> I was trying to help, help him out. Mm. Oh, this grand, my boy, grand, yeah, grand, grand, grand. <laughs> That's hilarious, man. I'm always looking for a sort of stupid laugh. When it comes, is Grant there? Oh, that. Oh, that's not Grant. That's real debates. That's correct. That's real debates. Yeah. <laughs> real debates. Yeah, goat mode got activated today in the fourth quarter. I see. Mm-hmm. Hey, hey, I can't hear me, Texas. Yeah. Yeah. Clutch field with the dunk, LBJ, 37 points. I mean, uh, break down the Grizzlies game, the base, the base, break down the game top to bottom because I ain't watching. I didn't watch. I didn't. You could be jumping your ball now. Uh, they had some good shooting, like a most of the uh, We like a day to go on defense. We tightened up on defense, crashed the boards better in the fourth quarter. Um, AD had a partial role in the fourth quarter, but uh, Bro, I had a lot of turnovers, and I guess he made up for that with that last-minute steal and dunk. Really needed that to close the game. It was seeming like the Grizzlies were really hustling back, trying to get in it late. Um, we got up by 13. The most we got up was by 13. The most they got up by it was nine in the game. Um, we beat them on a fast break. We beat them points in the paint. Uh, it just was LBJ having the turnovers. d didn't hit a damn three. And, uh, you know, we was like a day's going defense. But uh, we tightened up on defense. LBJ took charge. He got that steal, got the dunk, sealed the game, man. 37 points, man. Double, double man. I mean, AD had a solid game, too. Um, those dudes got to set the tone. I mean, it started from the top to get to and the fix bottom. And Fix the mic a little bit, debates. AD and LeBron got to set the tone. Um, and I think they did, yeah, the they did that in the fourth quarter. Yeah, you clear go, Mike. So, uh, yeah, they did that. And we got it done. Let's see here. He can't, he can't hear me, Texas. Or somebody. I hear you. Your mic's kind of, it's, it, it's kind of got a, a muffle or something. Is it clear I don't know now? if you got headphones on. Right? Yes, there you go. What, whatever you did, you clean it now. Yeah, so we, we, uh, we should have definitely won by 10 or better. But at the end of the day, um, like I was trying to tell guys, these dudes is pros. We've seen the Bucks, the Celtics, and multiple teams lose the teams they shouldn't have lost to. Um, because of the simple fact, these dudes is professional basketball players. All oh, this is a team full of G Leaguers. They're not in the G League, they're in the NBA for a reason. They're pros. Um, so if you play around, they will do what they got to do. Um, and we've seen that multiple times this season against highly touted team, teams that got a reputation of being having multiple superstars and supposed to win in games. You know, Celtics, the Bucks, Lakers, Clippers. Um, so glad we got the win, um, but it should have not been that close. Uh, AD and LeBron should have been hustling like this for the Minnesota game, but. It is what it is. Take what you can get. Glad we got the dub. What do you got on LeBron on that steal, man? What do you what's what's going through your head on LeBron about that steal? Somebody had to do it. I mean, they were stalling them out, but they didn't get no real stop like a block or a steal. Uh just needed to do something to break the game all the way open so that they wouldn't be able to come back because it was way too close. Uh, so LeBron stepped up and did that. But like I said, he can only do that in spurts. He can't do that for a whole playoff series and stuff no more. He's too old. Like he already just said, that, like he pick his spots. Um, so luckily he had enough in the tank to do that. Hopefully he don't got to keep playing 41 minutes. 
um, you know, every time and he can, you know, be in that 35 minute range and AD and other guys to play substantial minutes. But like I said, what do you want AD dropping 36? I mean, you know, I'm not impressed or nothing like that. You know, he gonna drop that if he get hot. Um, to me, he should add 40 or 50 because they ain't had nobody out there. You know, they was relatively very small. They didn't have nothing going on. Um, but, you know, he had a solid game. He had a good game. They're going to knock off the one seed. And uh, I would bet people, but my cash app, I can't transfer money if I lose. But um, so Lakers are going to be, they're going to they're gonna make history. Remember I said that. Oh, yeah. If, if he can make this run, you got to say he's a goat. This, this entire day. Yeah, they're fine. All right, they're going to find them. But how, what's, how, hold on. How, how's it going, DeBeach? DeBeach, uh, Mike. Hey, yo, and... can I just say this real quick? I got stuck, man. I was in the room. I was, in, I was logging on, and I got stuck. So um, it's all good, man. Thank you all, though, man. I appreciate you all, man. I really do. Hey, yeah, man, we ain't, we ain't gonna have nobody have come on, come on and show show some things they don't they, they don't want to they don't feel comfortable showing. You know what I'm saying? No, I mean I, I appreciate that. I got stuck for some reason. I was trying to uh hit the button for the camera, and it just wasn't you. You mean to say, Lafonso? Hey, Lafonso, you got stuck. How LeBron be get stuck on defense? You yeah, got you know that nigga, Hey, you know how the nigga stand at the end of the end of the court while the other play is going on. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Is real the base in here? Yes. <laughs> what do you think about Russell Wilson saying he opened the doors for black QBs, man? He capping big time, ain't he? Big time. Like a mother. Why do you say that? Like I don't a know. Mother. What's wrong with that guy? Ever since he got with Sierra, he hasn't been the same, bro. Right, he was with them hey, pretty hey, hey, upper class girls. He got with Sierra, start feeling a little bit hood. He got with somebody. Mm -hmm. with That's what I'm trying to tell you, bro. That's he what I'm saying. A woman who knew how to throw her hips, and she been throwing them hips into him, and now oh he's coming. Oh my god! Because you know he's trying to talk with Slane. You know when he met Mike Tomlin, they show I saw I saw a shoe. He's like, "What's up, baby?" I'm like, "What? What do what you talk like this?" Mm -hmm. Yeah. What baby. the heck, bro? Well, he's weak anyway, so he so so it, he can easily be like this says in the word toss like the you know uh, unstable minded man toss like the wind. Hey Texas, you know what it is? His career is gone, bro. He know it. His career was based on the Seattle team where they had all them great players. Russell yeah. Wilson has never, ever, and I mean ever, did it by himself like that. Like John Elway took a team, bro. Like Tate Manny, like uh 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 what's his name? Tom Brady, bro. Russell Wilson ain't got that in him. No. Oh, in a uh, real debate, I got something for you. You you there? You there, bro? Mm -hmm. what's, up? what's up with your boy, bro? Sitting out like that, man. Mm -hmm. LBJ. I mean, he got the dub, man. Um, you talking about last game? The last game, I think a game before he that, he, he set out. No. Talk to me. Talk, explain. Let me he understand, bro. Sick. I mean, what you want me to say? He said he was sick. Okay, let me ask you a question, though, bro, because I ain't heard nobody on here say this yet. Okay? If he was sick, how did he come back and play the next game? Because if you got the flu, right? How do you come back and play the next game? They said they were giving him round o'clock treatment. So, I mean, that's probably why. You got to understand oh, the way that the way that technology and the uh, M&Ms are in today's day, anybody could do anything. We just watched Aaron Rodgers te tear his Achilles, and he was back walking like a few days later. Okay, so no let me questions. ask you a question then, uh, 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 Real Debate. Let me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. if, if, if it took all that to shoot LeBron up and make him come back, what good did it do? 
We got the dub tonight, so I must have did some good. You got the question dub because of him. Well, come on, man. Won. You talking about the Grizzlies, bro? Won. Okay, let me ask you this question. What do they got? What? Two games left, right? One, one more. One game left. One game. Hold on. Yeah, one more, I believe. One more. Now, you got to remember this, uh, uh, Real Debase. They had a chance to probably get to the 60, right? Yep, they blew it. Okay, do you do you who who do you brought? Uh, okay, let me ask you, who do you blame for that? LBJ and AD. Thank you. <sighs> I'm done. Uh, Your Honor, I I I I I'm done. Court is adjourned. <laughs> Y'all ever had these Welch's fruit snacks, the berries and cherries? These are delicious. Oh, yeah. And another thing I'm sick of the motherfucking Los Angeles Lakers fan saying is they blame everything on every coach. We're going to beat y'all ass, Lafonso. We're going to beat Denver down. Yeah, I'm taking and the Lakers you know to what? do the unthinkable. I would love for y'all to meet us. And see, y'all better off meeting us in the NBA, uh, the uh, Western Conference Finals. Y'all don't want to even meet us in the first round. I want to meet y'all in the first round. Fuck that. Yeah. LeBron James is hot. LeBron and AD play like this. LeBron James! One and eighty for play like this every night. They beat them. We need to, we need to trade AD for Wemby, bro. He locked down the Nuggets by himself tonight. Nigga, y'all need to trade AD bro. for Cinderella. He's a great for who? Defensive player. Listen, for right Wemby, he is a top five defensive player ever right now. Why would they? Why would they get rid of him, Wemby? Yeah, you're, you're being sarcastic, aren't you? He too great, bro. He too great, bro. Defensive you know what? Give us AD. Like we'll, we'll take AD. And matter he fact, we'll destroy the all. Joker. We'll, we'll Destroyed him. No, yeah. we're not giving y'all Joker. We'll give y'all uh Michael Porter Jr. Bro, we Texas, want Joker. I told, Fuck that. Night, I told Texas last night about Wimby. I told y'all, bro. Oh, I know you've been the best player in the league. He neutralized the whole team in the fourth quarter, bro. I ain't seen nothing like him in my life. Nothing close. But here, he here's did. the problem. Here's the problem, real debate. You think you can analyze a fucking Kansas City uh 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 <laughs> game? You drinking. think you can analyze a LeBron game, nigga? You don't even know because your teams like you put Patrick Mahomes under uh LeBron James. They put him under. I don't wait time out. Now I'm going against each other. I don't like so they. Football I didn't follow it tonight. Football. So the Nuggets number three right argument. now. That was a spontaneous argument that came out of nowhere that Texas brought up a couple times about I what about I'm Mahomes home. making a goat debate over LeBron. Oh, you know that's true. Yeah, you know, you know. Uh, yeah, based on the things that you threw in there, that was all things that could happen. You know, that will happen. Some could. Right, can I say this win. then? Can I say this? Uh, real debate. Texas, big Texas. Y'all <laughs> make this channel, bro. Y'all make this channel go. Along with I Chris just come here to talk some stuff. Go, That's go it. Mike with his bullshit. It, but anyway, um, um, and go Mike. You know I'm fucking with him, but uh, 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 infamous, um. <laughs> Uh, Afonso, um, listen, man. There's a lot of people here who could talk sports, man. But I'm gonna tell you something, man. Real oh. base. Stop hiding when your team lose, bro. <laughs> I'll be hiding when they lose. I came on here when they lost against the T Wolves. You break it up really bad at my end. I came on here when they lost the last game. Uh, guess what? The Denver Nuggets beat the T-Wolves. You seen that? Our, our last game? Okay, but y'all just got beat by Wemby by himself, single-handedly. Nigga, oh. that? Does that make you happy? Joker tried his signature move and Wemby blocked it like it was a kid. Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Did Joker show, show that signature move against the Lakers and it work? Um, hey. You know, that's, that's what I thought. Moves. That's what They'd I thought. Working. That's what I thought, nigga. Looking fine. Slam the gavel. Talking this shit. Slam the gavel, <laughs> nigga. But you know that rookie <laughs> man, Jokic is bitch, though, right? Nigga, you, you talking you know about other man, teams? I'm you talking know that about your team. Made Jokic his bitch. 
You know that, Yo, right? Your team, nigga. <laughs> you go, That's okay. You can call Jokic a bitch, but guess it, what? Is we, no, I ain't say he was a bitch. I said he was made a bitch by Victor Wimbignana. Okay, but is that your team? Nope. I don't want it to okay. be my team. Tell me when your team do it, <laughs> then I'll pay attention more. Okay. You understand me? Mm-hmm. I hear you. Okay. We gonna say yeah. out of the front range. Don't tell. No, they're not playing the Nuggets. Nuggets are number three now, I believe, from what I'm seeing. Man, the, I want the, the Nuggets in the front room, man. Fuck. Fine. Oh, let me you check this. this. You seen See, that? I'm gonna tell y'all something, man. That y'all Lakers fans don't know. If y'all get the Lakers, bro, y'all should want them in the first round, not the NBA. Uh, Western Conference Finals. Y'all should want them in the first round. So they won't get in rhythm, huh? Well, because they'll be more likely to be uh-huh. careless. I want Dallas to get to number six so they can take out Denver. Because I, I think, think Dallas, Dallas can't. You know why Dallas yeah, can't? Yeah, they're four and five, yeah. They're five, yeah. Dallas can't, yeah, exactly. Oh, they're going to oh, they're gonna wipe out the Clippers like a, like a, like a... <laughs> Like a, like a, never mind. I, was, I wanted to say it, but I'm not going to say it. I keep saying they're hey, going to destroy hey, the Clippers, Texas, bro. Texas, let me ask you a question. If, yeah. you think, if you think the Lakers and the Clippers met in the first round, for whatever reason, do you think the Lakers can take out the Clippers in the first yeah, round? Yeah, absolutely. Because, the, yes, the Clippers play too much ISO ball, and you're going to see it against the Dallas Mavericks. The Mavericks are going to show you team ball. They're they're the most complete team in the NBA outside of the Nuggets for, for right now, but I still got LA going all the way. I'm telling wow. you, watch, watch what I tell you. Dallas is getting ready to wipe them out like an outbreak. But see, man, I don't have a lot of confidence in Dallas defense. Mm-mm, no, their defense, their defense has, has been um, improving substantially. Since Just what? I mean, What's up? Uh, they defense. I think in the 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 first part of the they year, the defense good. was the worst. And then I think in the last what twenty games or so, they defense. The last defense. month they've been, yeah. I mean they've been getting stops like crazy. I don't know where they rank right now, but I mean all I know is that it, all that matters is what you're doing at this point of the season, and they're That's doing right. the right things, doing the right things, and uh, they play good I team defense. They play this, good team this, defense, yeah. Because this is the time you want that rhythm. And I think the bigs are going to be able to destroy in the paint both sides of the ball. Because don't sleep on Daniel Gaffer. He, he can put up 15, 16 any night. And they got some pretty good wings, don't they? Yeah. They got lights out shooters, clutch shooters, Cleaver. I keep saying Cleaver, uh, who's uh, excellent. Um, Hardaway when he gets streaky. And then they, and they still have Washington's okay. You still have to respect him. Uh, who else am I missing? Josh Green is okay. But, but, um, She's a second-year player. Uh, they have someone else, too, that I'm missing that can shoot. So so let me tell y'all what we're going to be about. When we come into the playoffs, Joker's the leader. Jamar Murray, he's coming off an injury. I think he's going to be okay. <clears throat> and guess this. Whoever we face, we're going to be able to execute like we normally do. Pope, Michael Porter Jr., um, this this lineup of ours is not the deepest, but at the same time, the way they play together, that Mike Malone got them to play together, it's a team to deal with. Now, did we lose some things from last year? Yes, we did. But can we capitalize off that? Yes, we can. Um, I believe that uh, if we met the Los Angeles Lakers, Minnesota Timberwolves, any of them teams, seven-game series, we can beat them. And I'm sorry, man, for y'all Laker fans. Y'all are so unbalanced. It's, it's unbelievable. What's Laker fans going to beat the T-Wolves or the, or the Denver Nuggets? Who wants to smoke? Oh, I bet if y'all <laughs> face, face the T-Wolves, they got y'all. We do. We just going to foul Gobert 20 times in a row. Make him take free throws. Well, first of all, do y'all know when AD coming back? He already came. To, he played tonight. Oh, did he? I didn't yeah. watch the game tonight. Anthony, Anthony Davis against the Grizzlies tonight 
had 36 points, 14 rebounds, and five assists. Well, who on the Grizzlies team can hold him? That's what the I only thought. thing they can hold AD is to win. Who on the Grizzly teams can hold AD for real? G Jerry Jackson got a DPO on his resume. Jerry did Jackson he, won did DPO he, watch a couple did years he, ago. Did he play tonight? <laughs> You talking yes. about the same Jerry Jackson that had a highlighter dunking on AD and then he got destroyed? Either way, it doesn't, bro. The base, the base, the base. Listen for a second. Whether you, no matter what you think about the base, listen. No matter what you think about Jerry Jackson, the man got a DPO on his resume, so he right. he didn't he didn't stop he couldn't stop AD. Those are the facts. So Jerry Jackson is a DPO wild. He, he's not a scrub. On defense, we're not saying he's a world beater on defense, but he does got a DPO on the resume. So we got a the base. I'm arguing for AD, so don't do that. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Go, Mike. Let's say if AD do dominate him, what are the other parts of y'all game coming from against them? LeBron James, Austin Reeves. The role players have to play is the biggest role. If D Lo would have yep. hit of, if D Lo would have hit at least three of them five threes, we would have been in a better position. And if See, that's, you know what's crazy about y'all team? Eight, four turnovers instead of eight, or three turnovers instead of eight. Like the turnovers from LeBron and D Lo missing them threes gave them a lot of extra possessions. See, this and is crazy. Part, and, and hey, D -Lo, wait, can I say this? Go ahead. This is crazy about a part about y'all team. Y'all have to pray every night that these players can deliver. For us, we know they're going to deliver. <laughs> well, why is you saying that? And Wimby just made y'all bow down and become his bitch tonight. Malone and became his we, bitch. Wait, 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 wait. We, eyes? What team are you talking about? The San Antonio fucking Spurs. Okay, you're not talking about the Los Angeles Lakers, nigga. Check me. <laughs> Bro, did you see Joker do I that? I don't care what any other team block. did. We talking about the Lakers against the Nuggets, nigga. That nigga, that nigga looked back at the referee. Like, so man, what? He that's that's, that's referee. not y'all. That's, like, yeah, that's, that's not y'all. That's not y'all. Go Mike, Texas. It's that's the first not time in history. Yeah. I keep seeing dudes get blocked. They look back and looking for a foul. The referee like, no, he fucking blocked. Is, is like, that y'all, though? Is, is that y'all? So he blocked. He fucking blocked to get blocked. I, hey, I really right. you you this is stop it, bro. Really you stop the stop whole thing. Remember how good is the, 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 the ground he covers, how tall he is, and how long he is. The base. He single handedly stop. stopped the you know whole why? fucking team. We ate and over against y'all the last eight games, nigga. Stop the bullshit. Remember, remember how Gomez? Here's the here's the whole point. The fact that this man got blocked by a rookie. If LeBron got blocked by William Bamba, they be talking about that shit for fucking years. Yeah, be because you know what? You know why, though? LeBron is told at a higher standard. But they're no, talking LeBron about it right now. They're, they're, no, LeBron is hated. But, but hold on, but here's the thing. Joker has multiple MVPs. He got a championship on his resume. Bro, this shit better be on ESPN for at least a week. Let me ask Bro, you this question. Him. Between you go, Mike, Texas, and, and Real Debates. If, if, if Joker got his shot blocked for the LeBron, which one would be talked about the most? Yeah, LeBron. Right now, if we're talking about, you. If we're talking about right now, LeBron is hated. If we're talking about, here, here's the thing, though. If we're talking about in LeBron's prime, oh, it's LeBron no, all no, day. No, 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 no. We're not but backing right up. Now, we're going to keep it right here today. The fact that Joker got blocked, the See, fact that he got a question, team, bro. Hey, the fact that he got a rookie black man, you know, this, all started with him, him. this all started with him talking about how he lost against the T-Wolves, right? But think about how that rookie Wimby made y'all bow down and become his bitch tonight. So what, think about yo, that. nigga? That's not y'all, though. That. You bitch-ass yeah. nigga. How about them? Aiden's gonna... That's not y'all, though. You talking about other Joker teams watches. replacing what you yeah. want your team to do. Aiden's gonna make Joker wash his clothes. Hey, hey, you know what, real debate? If you a big LeBron fan, you should be expected more, right? Mm -hmm. Man, shut the fuck up, nigga. <laughs> hey? Nigga, you talking about other teams, what they did to us, 
What about your team, nigga? Man, Aiden's gonna, Aiden's, gonna, Aiden's gonna dunk on Joker and make Joker bow down. That nigga talking about other teams. That's what. Uh, that's disturbing to me. You need Listen, therapy. You, you need basketball therapy, you bro. When Bianca gonna make niggas wanna retire? I'm telling you, bro. He is. When Obama is the next, he's the next Yao Ming. Just black. Bro, he worship, bro. Hold on. He's man. much better than Yao Ming. Y'all know, y'all know about that dude at me or whatever his name is. The white boy that played for uh that college basketball team. Man, that fucker taller than Shaq, man. Yeah, I the big man in the, the paint for Purdue. Yeah. If I'm the damn Lakers, exactly. I'm taking you. Uh, shut down real the base. I'm trading. I'm trading. I'm trading, uh, I'm trading some players for William Bamba in the offseason. This nigga went to another Let's team. Trade AD for Williamiana, bro. We gonna win like two titles in a row, guaranteed. Let's trade oh. AD right now for Williamiana, right now. Oh, man. Let's now. Up. I know. This is sexy, right now. Now what? Now what? Can somebody title. stop this shit? <laughs> No, I'm serious. We will win the title. I guarantee it. We right now, nigga. What right about now. right now? We talking right now. <laughs> yeah, right now, oh, bro. Okay, stop right moving now. to the future. Stop moving to the past. Put your ass where's that and go to the future, I watched, nigga. I, how, come, how come Zubox was able to shut down Joker three straight possessions? That was crazy. He shut him down three straight times in the post. Was it your team? <laughs> I watch AD do it. See, this, this is the I thing about y'all. Too. This is what y'all do. Y'all brag about other teams stopping our players, but when y'all team don't do AD it, did it too. nothing. And then when AD y'all shut team them down too, other folks. team that y'all talking about shut down our players, y'all hate them. Niggas knock that shit off. Man, AD can shut y'all down too. Especially that's niggas. Hey, AD can, AD can guard. It's AD even can guard. with y'all and, and us. We knocked y'all off Western Conference we're, Finals 2020. We're, we're not. Hold on, we're, listen. We're, listen. Wait, wait, we wait, 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 Y'all knocked wait, us wait, off wait. last year. It's even, okay? Wait, 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 wait. Can you wait, little Bay City, Michigan-ass nigga? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now, let me tell you why I'm saying wait. You're right about that. Y'all did get us in the bubble. Then we got y'all back. And we even. Right? Mm-hmm. But if mm-hmm. I was to say to you, do you know the history of the Denver Nuggets and the uh, Los Angeles Lakers history? It goes beyond that with Kobe, Carmelo. Do you know that? <laughs> Carmelo a bum. Man. Hey, Come yo, on, yo, yo. Camilla Andy's only known for his offense. Go ahead, yeah, Texas, Texas. Let me just ask you yo, something, yo. Texas. Texas. Yeah. Yo, Fon, yo Fonzo, you? Fonzo. I got I to gotta say something. Let, let, pro, you okay. don't need Hold to play. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. 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 Wait, 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 Go ahead. No, Fonzo, I say, I say, you don't need to argue this. One team is headed to the playoffs. The other team is headed on, headed to Cancun. Thank Why is this even an argument? Thank no, you. This is not even a discussion. Go. Thank you, Playboy. Hey, Mike, you that be, you know, I'm talking about San Antonio. Money. I'm talking about Mike San Antonio. Oh, okay, about okay, Kahuna. okay. Do your intro. Yeah, I'm talking about San Antonio. Hey, Infamous, I'll put the, I'll put the weapon up. Infamous, okay, you, you're okay. <laughs> no, I was talking, no, I was talking about San Antonio. I, why are we? Why is this even an argument? Well, well, San Antonio is, is a is a non-playoff well, they, team. They highlight. Well, hey, no, we got to be. If you know, we be when they talk about San Antonio. I ignore that. We got to. We, oh, okay. we have to honor. We have to honor this though, Infamous. We have to honor this though. The fact what? that we're giving we're giving uh Joker how they do LeBron. When niggas do shit on LeBron, they say, "Oh, how the rookie scored on LeBron." Or how does the rookie block LeBron? Remember, remember how Gomez, the, the the nigga Gomez from the uh the Knicks, blocked uh mm-hmm. LeBron, and they were talking about that shit for a whole week. So what they were saying is we got to give Joker that same energy. You got blocked by a rookie. Infamous. I brought it up because he brought up us losing against the T Wolves. That's a playoff team, right? Infamous. Well, guess what? Wimby shut the whole fucking operation down. He came in there. He seen the dope. He said none of that. Took all the dope out the house. You hear me? <laughs> hey, hey, infamous. See, the, well, the thing they not get it's not about the past; it's about the current. The Los okay. Angeles <laughs> have lost the to the he Denver Nuggets the in the last eight games. 
and we still nobody cares about the regular season. You can be in the regular season all you want. You've only beat us. The Lakers have faced each other how many times in the playoffs? At least two, three times in the playoffs. You know the like fucking I, like Lakers. I said, y'all better they have a winning record. To meet us in the first round. Then the West. The Lakers have a winning. Here's the here's the downfall. Here's the downfall of that whole segment. The okay. Lakers have a winning record against Denver in the playoffs all time. They also have a winning record in the regular season, especially when it matters. But still, Mike, you're going to matter. the past, bro. I'm talking about current. As in, we you can beat y'all now. What, what does the old word say? What have you done for me lately? Nigga, we, we, can beat beat we can beat y'all. We have beat your ass the last eight games we the played. The NBA is rigged, sir. The NBA is rigged. The, you, you don't think the Nuggets? The NBA you don't is think? If the NBA listen, wants to, if the I NBA wants the Nuggets to, no, listen to what I'm saying. Playboy, the Playboy. NBA, Playboy. Hold on, doors. Hold on, doors. If the NBA wants the Nuggets to not beat the Lakers, they can make the Lakers fucking win. Don't get it so fucking you twisted. You saying that we right now going on rig then, right? What I'm what I'm going off of the the bro bro the NBA is a business. It's entertainment. It's a business. It's not it's not all about the players. It's a business. The NBA is so a you're whole saying business. they have the NBA has to rig it for the Lakers to win. Is that what you're saying? What I'm what I'm what I'm saying is the nut. I believe the NBA will let LeBron James win at least one more reign before he hangs it up. I believe that. Listen, 100%. when the Lakers face Denver, I'm coming on this panel and I want all That's the best. Denver, on, Denver, on, Denver on, is going to lift up their listen skirts. Listen, exactly. listen what I'm saying. Listen what I'm saying real quick. I'm gonna, take off their high I'm going to bring up a couple. I'm going to bring up a couple reasons why I believe that. When Ray Lewis was in his last little year, and he said, "Look, I might not come back the next season, bro." Right, bro, 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 that same year he said that. What happened to the power? The power went the fuck out. Okay, okay. let's keep going. Tom Brady wait, wait, and his... Wait, 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 wait. Hold Can on, I let me that? finish, dude. Let me finish. Tom Brady, Tom Brady, when he played for the Bucks, that was his... Uh, it, I, I don't know if that was his last year, but it was close, close, I believe, to his last season. Bro, the Chiefs had three offensive linemen all catch C-19 at the exact same time right before the Super Bowl and missed that Super Bowl. Tom Brady wins that one. If you keep if you keep going down the list, right? You keep going down, right? You look at uh Pay Manning late his late in his stage. They let him win a Super Bowl back in 2016, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm just saying, bro, and bro, in sports, it's not all about the team. It's rigged. When you watch that Kings, who on the who on the panel, Texas or uh infamous? Did y'all watch the Sacramento Kings series when Sacramento against the Lakers? Bro, the Lakers referees, they gave the Lakers certain calls to make them win that game. That foul they called for Kobe Bean Bryant wasn't even a foul. So the thing that I'm saying is, did y'all watch that Warriors game infamous where the Warriors had a two-point lead and Klay Thompson catches the inbound pass? The referee's right there, and he's taking five, six, seven steps with the ball. So I'm just saying, bro, if the NBA wants you to win, you're gonna motherfucking win. It's kind of like it's kind of like Giannis when Giannis jumped for that lob. Did y'all see how uh, AD pushed the man? And the ref called nothing. He he kind of pushed, bumped him down low, and the ref called nothing. So the thing I'm saying is, bro, sports is not all, not all about the players. If the NBA tell you miss that fucking shot, you better miss that fucking shot. I'm done. Y'all niggas tripping. The NBA is a fucking business. The fuck? Did y'all not watch the fucking Chiefs Super Bowl when the Kyle Shanahan called timeout and told the coach don't call cover fucking zero? Or match zero, whatever that shit was, and he lost the fucking game? This is what you got for the Lakers against the Nuggets? Bro, the Nuggets not going to win this time. I'm telling you right now. I'm going to tell you why I'm saying they're going to win. Because if you look at your guy, your man LeBron James, and you look at your man AD, they ain't about it this year, bro. Mike, 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 how about this? How about this? How about we do this? How about we bet game game to game? No, bet the series. Well, you, you, you should, 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 you should
You should want to bet the series. Bet the series against him, Mike. I'm telling you. I'm betting the series because the Lakers, the Lakers are going to look, look, look. Here's what I'm saying, bro. After what LeBron James said about he might not have much time left, bro, I believe Adam Silver is shook. I believe he's thinking deep down. We got to get LeBron at least one more ring. He'll get two more. Okay, how about how about this then? How about we, we I'm putting in an, I'm putting in an injury exception though. I want an injury exception in it. So if one of the key <laughs> players goes down, no, I, I, <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I want an injury exception though. If I'm making the bet, I want an injury exception. No, if they AD, no, I make it fair. Mm. I make it fair. If Jokic, if Jokic or Jamal Murray goes down, the bet is off. And if if LeBron or AD goes down, it's off. All right. I'm taking. I'm taking that. I think I'm that's fair. That bet. I'm only. I'm only taking that bet because, like I told you, we all watched LeBron when he faced against Golden State in 2015 but when Golden State the ran nuggets, LeBron. Bro. Here's the point, bro. Here's the point that I'm here's the point that I'm getting to. When a team beats a team one time in the playoffs, they usually come back that next year and try to knock them off. Okay. If that makes you, any you, sense. I want you to show me a history of that because I can tell you a history. I'm gonna show you a history right here. When the Mavericks why don't you, beat, go, why don't you guys Mavericks, bet some real me, money? Me, hold on, let me finish. Don't worry. When the when when the Warriors faced against the Cavs in 2015, they rammed niggas off the fucking court. What happened the very next year in 2016? The Cavaliers said, we're going to beat your fucking ass. Then, then you keep going, right? In 2013, the Spurs got destroyed by the Heat. What happened the very... No, I might get the years backwards. I think the Spurs the ran them off that first time. The, yeah, facts. All right. No, no, no. The okay, Heat beat them the first time. The Heat beat them the first time. The Heat beat them... The Heat beat them... The Heat beat them in 2013. Uh, they came back the very next year and they had a record mark of three and went off the court. But I'm, so, I'm just saying every game I'm, was a blowout. Going off NBA history. If you go out there, if you go out to the his, if you go out to the history, bro, there's a lot of times where a team lost to a team that one time. The next time they played them, they tried to beat the fuck out them niggas. Okay, how about the Detroit Pistons beating the Chicago Chicago Bulls? Who? Couple years that, in a row. That actually, ha- that actually ha- bro. That actually happened. The Bulls lost to the Pistons that first go around, and MJ came back and beat the fuck out of Isaiah. Not the next year. Not the next year. They didn't. It wasn't. It, it wasn't. It wasn't the next year. But the next time he faced them, okay, it went so all I just out. Beat- your case. But the whole point that I'm making is, bro. I don't believe this team's gonna beat this 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 Laker team back to back in a playoff series. I believe this team gonna come back. And say fuck Murray and Joker for whooping y'all fucking ass. See, the same if way. Wanna, if you want to really huh? look at it though, bro, it's not based really on history. It's based on basketball. Y'all, y'all not even that good of a team this year. Y'all are not that good of a team, bro. You getting blocked by William Bomba. You can say bro, whatever you William want. Bamba can we don't care. Care. Anybody team. We don't You're not that you good. Michael Porter's not consistent. Say. Michael Porter's not consistent. Show me, show me ten games. Just show me ten games. Show me ten games of Porter. Can you show? Can you show me 10 games where Porter Jr. played consistent ball? It 10 doesn't games straight? matter. Can you, you show me that games? That stuff does matter. That stuff does out? matter. Y'all not it better than the Lakers. Because Michael You're Porter not better. Break the if, dumper. If y'all um, better than the Lakers, can you give me a LaFonso? LaFonso, I'm not arguing. LaFonso, I'm not going to argue with you. I'm going to say this uh, debate. Unless he put money on it, I'm not arguing with him. Because put uh, up or shut up. You already know I'm not going to put money on it, dude. I don't so I'm not going to argue with you, then. I'll make you a bet. If the Lakers not, are I'm not I, 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 I'll make you a bet. I'll make you a different bet, though. If, if we're not, if we're not, if we're not here, I will bet money. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Just hit me out. I'll make I'll you a different money, bet. Because you know? I don't bet I'm, money. I bet to you, if the Lakers beat the Nuggets, if they meet them, I will come down there and take you in a fire match round with boxing gloves. And <laughs> you see what I'm oh saying? <laughs> this is hilarious. You know, hey, you know, hey, know. hey, you better get ready. You better get ready. The Lakers, they meet them. They're gonna, I believe they're going to win. That's funny. The Lakers and, are going to win this down easy there. And Pagan, look at my win to loss record ratio. Pretty good. In a fire round with boxing gloves. <laughs> the Lakers. 
the Lakers are going to be Denver Nuggets. Gonna say nothing about it, we're going to say we're going to say I'm taking I'm taking all bets, Alfonso. I'm taking Alfonso. You taking that bet? Hold on, Alfonso. If you're taking the bet with me, I want I want an injury exception. My bet's with an injury exception. Alfonso, I'll bet you. It's look at the hole. Go ahead. Go ahead, Texas. No, I'll let Mike go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Go ahead. I'm gonna go when you're done. Go, Mike. I'll bet you two hundred on the Celtics. All I'm, all I'm saying Celtics is, you what? Have to Doris, you can Celtics might not you even make it to the finals. Who be talking, dude? Who <laughs> <laughs> be talking, bro? Celtics. Fuck up. I mean, Doris you need to really stop it. Stop it. You have not finished playing me yet, so you can't do that. The Celtics are frauds, Dor. Doors. The Doors Celtics are frauds, like bro. They're Monopoly money, bro. Try to, to try to cash Monopoly. Don't believe. Nobody believes in the Celtics. Nobody's scared of them. Go, Mike. He's you said you bet. Mike. You bet go the Mike. Celtics he the first round. When he, he just lost all cash of money to go, Mike. You lost, you, lost, you, lost, you lost over half a dollar, bro. Are they playing the first round? Yeah, we don't know Mike. who they're playing. Go you go said they're going to gonna lose the first round game, so let's put two hundred on it. Let's put two hundred on it. That'd be fun. They lost too. That'd be fun. They lost, bro. Dora, save your money, man. Save your money, bro. If they if they're playing the Hawks in the first round. I'm taking this bet for only one reason. Damn. KP KP is trash in the KP is trash in the pick and roll. He can't guard the pick and roll. If you're gonna play that guy in late game, you're fucked. They may cannot guard so the pick and roll for so the so the bet's on for two hundred, but only if the Celtics are playing the Hawks. If the Celtics are playing the Hawks, I'm taking two hundred because I don't believe KP Deal. can guard the pick and roll. Oh my god. Okay. Mike, I'm only, Mike, I'm only saying it because of, hold, hold on. Listen, 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 listen. If anybody go back and watch the tape, Robert Williams, look, look, here's what I'm saying. And please let me finish. The Boston Celtics team that had Robert Williams and Al Horford, they were decent at guarding the pick and roll. Decent. Not great, but decent. When you watch KP, he is garbage in the pick and roll. He is fucking. Lazy eyed, ball watching, don't rotate looking ass. This man cannot go to pick up hey. some shit. He's the same nigga that left a Murray wide the fuck over for a mid range shot for games. Stop. If the Lakers, if the Lakers beat the Nuggets, Mike, then, you picked the wrong game oh, though. Infamous. No, no, if the Lakers no, beat the Nuggets, if the Lakers beat the Nuggets, can no one hear me? Him. Go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. Texas, go ahead. I anybody hear what I just? I think Texas might be the only person that get kind of get what I'm saying. When you got yeah. a Robert Williams. Right, he's athletic. He can switch in the pick and roll and still guard the rim. When you watch KP, he's slow footed. He 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 can't jump. He's not quick re re reacts to the ball. When you put him in the pick and roll, he's lost, bro. I watched the Hawks, Texas and Edmonds. I watched the Hawks come down the court five straight possessions and said, "We're gonna put you in the pick and roll. What you gonna do about it?" And the man couldn't do shit. And when the Celtics did blitz off the pick and roll, they left niggas wide the fuck open. Why? I'm telling booty naked open. Stop it. Mike, the Mike, Mike be, pe be prepared to do some overtime, man. Be prepared to ask your boss for some overtime. It. I'm not worried about it at all because as long as KP right. on that court, if KP <laughs> don't play in the fourth quarter, then I'll regret, I'll, I'll regret this bet. But if KP is on the court in the fourth quarter, Boston is fucked. I mean, bro, if you're the Boston Celtics, you better not play KP. In the Hold on. Wait, what's the bet again? What's the bet again? Just the first game? The series. Who's going to win the series? If the you, better put a, you better put an injury exception in there. You better you're, put an injury not, exception. No, hold on. Hold, hold on. I don't no, care what the injury No injury is. exceptions. No, no, okay. no. Listen. Listen. I will not put no injury exception because I believe KP will be in the game in the fourth quarters and the, and the Hawks are going to hunt his ass like a fucking bear. Like a, no, like a hawk. Like a hawk. I'm I'm making no bet with no injury. I'm putting the injury exception in any bet I make, especially yeah. with the NBA. And you should I get Mike the benefit that. because I only, I only have I only have balls takes to get uh, only only have balls against the Southern because like I said, KP that 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 nigga is bro. He slow. He slow so fucking slow. In the pick and roll, he is garbage. Are you he gonna take more of my money, Go Mike? Are you gonna, gonna take, take more? I'm gonna 
the the only thing to save you, uh, the worst, the only the only way you're gonna be saved is if KP if KP gets in foul trouble. He's Doris, so like so wait a minute, Doris. Doris, Doris, can I Doris, can I ask you a question? Is this gonna cancel out the original amount that you owe? Are you using this no. to cancel I, it out? No, I still owe hundred, so he would owe me hundred at worst case. Otherwise, I'd owe him oh, three. Oh, okay. You already paid him six hundred, so you can't even it. out. Here's it. No, a no, little more it. than six. But yeah, here's the here's the thing. Here's the thing, here's the, here's the thing Texas and Infamous. Do y'all know? Mm -hmm. Do y'all know why I'm not gonna take the four hundred? Because this the same nigga that betted me three 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 hundred something, and it's taking him. Uh, no, he betted me two hundred recently, and it's taking you over a week to pay. So I'm not gonna <laughs> take the four hundred. <laughs> <laughs> Four hundred doors, man. What do you mean? He got, he got you there. Whoever, doors, he got you there, bro. He got you. He got you by the tail right, right now. Whoever oh said that shit. He got well, you by the tail right now. Look, look. I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say this. I ain't taking oh, anything over a hundred because you took way too long to pay this. You still ain't paying me the two hundred. Yeah, you paid me Mike, hundred. Mike, how about we do this? How about we do this? How do how do we have a mediator, a guy in the middle where everybody sends their money to that we trust? That way we don't have to worry about stuff. How we get, how like we gonna this. do that shit when Doris taking all this time? But how we gonna do this when Doris taking all this time? That's not trustable. No, yeah, but I'm saying that's what I'm saying. Stakes. Don't make the bet. The bet is not gonna be made until people send their money. You don't make bets with somebody that ain't settled the bet they already made, man. I paid you right, six, exactly. Seven Thank you. Go Thank you. Fuck out of here. You said what? Texas, you there? Texas? What you say? Yeah. You see how good my said I pay you six hundred out of seven hundred. But you have not, bro. bro. You don't make another bet with somebody after they haven't paid the full. It's like 35 yeah, dudes talking at one time. Nobody cares about, yeah, hold on. One do, at a, one do at a time, please. Nobody cares we about them. That's like, that's like, that's like saying, hey, hey, LaFonza, I paid you uh, 500 in the past. What does it got to do with you pay, trying to pay me 200 now? I don't even know what you're talking about, bro. I'll come out. No, no, no. Here's what I'm, no, LaFonza, here's what I'm talking about. Doors has lost a lot of bits to go Mike. He's lost bits up to six hundred and some dollars. <laughs> That's right. sad. He's, he's That's bringing sad. He's, he's bringing he's bringing up he's bringing that up. He's bringing that up to cover up for the fact that he still owe me another hundred from the two hundred. Wow. <laughs> so he, wait, 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 Mike. Hold on, time out. So he owes you seven hundred plus dollars and all once he pays the extra seven hundred dollars. Yes. That's sad, bro. Wow. Hey, that's so he's using Yo, Doris, 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 that's he's embarrassing, using bro. bro. At this point, that's, it, it, that's it, it, bad. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Go that's back. almost wait, rent wait, for some wait, places wait, 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 in the country. No, I paid I paid him six hundred. No, let Doris, me finish. I'm going Lafonso. I don't owe him seven hundred. I owe him a hundred. I've paid him six hundred. If you listen, that's what I just said, sir. That's what I just said. If you listen, that's what I just said. God dang it, y'all don't listen to anything. My God! One at one, one at a time, one at a time. I can't hear yeah, what's going and, on. And, Go and, and, and Doris, stop I was trying to tell y'all that. Bro. Stop Betty, man. Yeah, Doris, you stop need to stop, bro. Stop Betty, man. No, leave you him need to stop. You need to stop. Leave him alone. He grows. No, hey, just no, keep putting your money away, bro. We're just trying to give him some no, good no, advice. No, he needs to stop. Face. I understand you what you're saying, but sometimes he's been saying for like two weeks. He's not going to take it, bro. A grown man, as a man, as a man, Doris, as a man, Doris, you should always bet. <laughs> hey, Doris, can I bet you something, Doris? Can I bet Doris something? No, I'm not gonna take Doris' money, man. I am. I will. Hey, hey Doris, what's up, bro? Hey, Doris. Hey, Doris. Clippers Maverick series right now, hundred. I bought you a KP jersey, Doris. If 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 hey, Doris, I bought you a Drew Holiday and Tim jersey if, if you just bet. <laughs> y'all need y'all need doors alone, man. Y'all yeah, abusing man. this man. Y'all taking yeah, he advantage abused himself. of this man. He abused himself. Y'all taking advantage of this man's problem, man. Y'all need to cut it out, man. Oh, he's probably okay. Yeah, yeah. Y'all need to cut it out, man. Doors, you want to build the Mavericks Clippers? I'll take the Mavericks seriously. Okay, I mean, Doris, man, you're this? losing how to go, Mike, Mike, man. Come on, now. Mike, bro. Mike got you for almost eight hundred dollars totality once you pay everything. Yeah, that's bad, bro. Hey, like, I, I, I couldn't live that. like that. <laughs> nah. I, I'm not in. I'm not in too Betty on here, but Go Mike got me one time. But I'll be god dang if he gets eight hundred out of me. Hey, wait, wait, Texas, Texas. Let me ask you a question. Go Mike think, has never gotten if you, me. If you think the the Nuggets and the Lakers <laughs> met in the first round, do you think the Nuggets will beat the Lakers, or do you think the Lakers are better off meeting the Nuggets in the Western Conference Finals? Western Conference. 
I got good Mike four times, five times to be exact, but hey, go ahead. No, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I, I think the Nuggets, no, no, I think I, the, I, I agree with you, Texas. I think it's better if they meet them in the finals. Yeah, yeah get in your groove, your rhythm, yeah. I'm gonna do like, I'm gonna do like most boxers do. I'm, I'm straight ducking Texas. You better duck you me better like duck, missiles in Afghanistan. Me, you better duck me too, because I've taken some money off your, <laughs> off your, in, off your, out of your pocket. I definitely, <laughs> I, I definitely ain't been against the. I, de I definitely ain't been against nigga that that, that does eighty strokes. Hell no. Hey, hold on, hold on, Mike Alfonso. You ever see y'all see Transformers? Can y'all hear me? I hear you. Yeah. Y'all see Transformers? Right. Y'all see Transformers? The seven kinds are flying through the city, and they're and, and Sam w w Wiki's trying to duck them. The main character Shia LaBeouf, and you're like, "Where's the boy?" <laughs> That's how Mike should be ducking me. Yeah, I'm a Decepticon. Exactly. <laughs> that was a little funny, but I'm sorry. Doors, man. You, you need how, how Earl Spence is ducking uh, Crawford for round two. I ducked that. No, I wouldn't duck him. I'd fight him again. If I get Molly whopped again, oh well. Doris, 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 you need to stop betting, bro. You need to stop betting. Yeah, you need, you're not good at this. You're not good at this. <laughs> yes, you are good at this, man. Come on, believe I'll me. Give him you're, the you're not good at this, man. You need to stop, bro. You're a, you're, you're a Celtics guy. Come on, man. Celtics are smart. Hey, man, infamous. <laughs> we telling you the truth, bro. Yeah, we are. We're, trying, we're just trying to help. These guys are Raptors fans. All you're you a Boston you fan. Come on, man. Mike, bro. Stop, You're bro. a Boston Stop. fan. Come on, man. Doors, at least throw a stipulation in there, man. An injury okay. exception, man. Put an injury exception. Man, Doors, don't be a bitch, man. You're a Boston fan. <clears throat> Put an injury exception Why? in it, man. Why? If Doors is the real man, he can work. But Mike, man, you gotta, Mike. It's not you. Gotta let him pay you back the full amount first before you make another one, man. Don't, don't. Real debates is right. He's got to settle it first, man. Yeah, go and do that. You guys got to always bet. I ain't going to lie to you. If I had bet at Doris sooner, I might have been rich by now. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> That's actually funny. <laughs> Doris, you know what he's calling you, right? I don't even want to say it on the mm -hmm, phone, bro. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he's calling you, uh, he. What it? What it? Um, I don't want to say it. Um, you, uh, yeah, Doris. He's he's basically he, tell, he's slapping he's you on money. the butt and telling you to hit the hit the streets. <laughs> <laughs> Doris, he's pimping you, bro. <laughs> yeah. Doors is being pimped by Mike. <laughs> hey, where my where, hey, where my boy Doors at? Go go give me that money. Hey, you work. All right. That's what hey, Mike is doing. Hey, Texas, Texas. Yeah. How much has Doors already paid Go Mike? Like six seven. Mm -hmm. Mike said he, he owes him. He paid him rent. <laughs> he's he's gonna owe him eight hundred dollars pretty much when it's all said and done. And if Mike wins this bet, if Mike wins this bet, you owe him like eight fifty. <laughs> this is funny. You go, Mike Cole. <laughs> hey, he just flat out said it. That's crazy. With that last one, we gotta calm down. Yo, um, can I ask don't. a question? One question, y'all. Has TJ has TJ paid his bet? No, he no. ain't shown since January twenty eighth, bro. When the Chiefs wow. missed his team, he ain't been back since, bro. TJ, wow. he's been uh, inside the dog infamous. infamous. You know that mm -hmm. Brandon hasn't been in here. He bet Texas. Yeah, uh, man, he ran, bro. Man, the hey, cats hey, are disgusting, you know what, man. You know cats are disgusting. Hey, Mike is ducking. He just went swimming, bro. Ever miss? Don't you think that mm -hmm. we can build a better system of betting? Because have a middleman that takes the money. That's what I was gotta, saying. We, Remember, we I, gotta, said we, we honest, I said that earlier. Yeah. Brand, Brandon's Brandon's feelings is hurts like Jelena hurts. The the only person I would nominate is Texas because I think Texas in. Integrity I would too. Yeah, I, think I haven't. Yeah, yeah. I haven't taken it. I'm, I'm, I'm not even bragging because I mean I'm trying to be more honorable towards the one above, and I yeah. So oh, I would yeah. send a, send so send the money to Texas. Have Texas yep. hold the money. Yep. And it will go from there. I, I think can hold the money do it from now. On. Yeah, I can just send it over to the person who who wins if y'all want to do that because yeah, I mean yeah. Way. I think that's the best way to do it. I'm not that's a snake. I'm not a snake. <laughs> I mean yeah. I am a yeah. snake in, in terms of uh you you if you come fight me I'm like anaconda. <laughs> But yeah, I'm not gonna. Texas, I'm, Texas, guess what though? That way, right there, nobody loses out. You the middleman. Yeah. Okay. Right. You know that yeah. I was watching and Go Mike said that Mookie do that. I was watching mm -hmm. watching Mookie channel. He does do that too. 
I couldn't even run away yeah. with the money, and I promise to God because my conscience would be effed up because it's just not. Yeah, but if, if if you do, if you don't, then you then then don't. If you don't feel comfortable, yeah, d yeah, go, Mike. I think you should seriously consider that. Make Texas yeah, the middleman. Texas, Texas is clarified as the middleman. Yeah, well, if he puts the money down, I'll give him a cash out. Because if the person don't put the money down, there's no bet. There's no bet. Yeah, exactly. There's no bet. Exactly. Right. You know what time they're on? Yeah. You let me know. So, so after after. After he paid me this last hundred, we're gonna put two hundred down for the uh the Hawks. Okay, so no. it's, it's official then. Texas will be the middle yeah. man. Right. No, right. I, no, no, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bet on I'm not gonna bet on two hundred for the fact you took too long to pay me this two hundred. So I'm I'm gonna knock it down to one hundred. And the winner, the winner, I'll just get the cash up right and just send out everything over, right? Yep. Yeah, you but wait a minute, Texas. Do you have can I ask a question? Do you have uh PayPal? No, I don't do PayPal, but Cash App. I do Cash App. Somebody else might have. I, I can get a PayPal. Because I, yeah, I can get a I PayPal. PayPal. If I'm gonna, if I'm gonna make any bets, I don't have Cash App. We don't have Cash I can, App. I can yeah, get a PayPal. You have to get a PayPal, Cash App, and yeah. I got a Cash App. Yeah. yeah, you need a pay. You need a Cash App and a PayPal. You got to set those two things up to be the middleman. In Texas, if you don't feel like sending them niggas the money, those send it. No, I'm not gonna take. Oh no, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna run for someone's money. money. I'm, bro, I'm really integrity guy, man. I know you are. I've been. Yeah, man, been God knows that. On the phone, bro. I know that. Man, so hold on. I was in uh, when I was back in a, in a, on, on in a, in a school before. Right. I just ran past somebody's wallet. God knows. I'm not trying to lie. He had sixty bucks. Now I didn't need it, but I could have said. Mm, okay, bro, 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 bro. We don't care about that right there. We don't care. And I I dropped it off at the uh, no, nah, I'm just saying I dropped it off at the uh, front desk over there because I don't yeah. stealing is not what I do. Yeah, I hear you, man. I hear you. Uh, unless I'm playing basketball Yo. or stealing off on somebody in the octagon. That's it. Yo, go I Mike. Did you, you see what Pagan you see what Pagan said about you? <laughs> Pagan always talking shit, man. I don't I, I, don't, I don't take Pagan. I don't, I don't even respond to Pagan, bro. I don't respond anymore. <laughs> He, he made comments about me. I don't that's respond. Hilarious. He called I, you a degenerate. Damn. Here's the, here's, the, here's, the, here's the whole thing. Here's the whole thing, is Miss. Anybody who you don't know is a woman or a man, you can't take serious. Mm -hmm. That's okay. true. Yeah, Pagan talks about me like tonight. I ain't respond to him. Something. Uh, he makes me laugh, man. I don't take him seriously. No, exactly. We don't know who Pagan is. We don't know Pagan's a bot, a woman, a man, a, a T word. We don't know. Man, that could be a Sasquatch yeah, behind that, the thing, that is man. True. Who knows? That is true. That could be a five-year-old kid man. behind yeah. the damn screen. You call a doctor. Yeah. That's a good point. Okay. <clears throat> that could be so behind the thing. You don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. That could be a fed. Mm. That could be fucking uh, uh, we don't, bird. We don't, we don't know. We don't know. Yeah, that could be. That could be Diddy. <laughs> that could be uh, EPD. <laughs> Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Yo, crack me up, man. Yeah, go ahead, bro. This is an interrupting chat because the Lakers they know not going to make the playoffs, and it's a disturbance. Real the base, he hang mm -hmm. back and lay cut. And yeah, Texas will tell you the truth. Go, Mike is going off hope, and there's no hope, bro. There's a lot. I agree with you. I, I, I agree with you, bro. We whooping y'all ass. Easy work. Hey, gentlemen, let me ask you something. Do you think the Los Angeles Lakers in the first round or in the NBA uh, West Conference Finals will beat, will beat the Los will, will beat the Denver Nuggets? I rather I rather them face them in the Western Conference Finals. To be honest with you, that's what I, I think I they have a better exactly. chance. Exactly. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah. It's no guarantee Denver gets there, though. It's no guarantee Denver gets there, though. That that is true. That's what I'm saying. Here's the thing, mm -hmm. though. What the Lakers going to make it to the Western Conference Finals, looking at the way they plan, they will be on a roll. The Lakers might not make it. Yeah. They, uh, they, they here's will. the thing. They, they there's going to be a – here's the thing. There's going to be a lot of luck that's going to be in play here because, listen, if one of these guys go down, like one of the major stars go down, that's a major advantage, oh, yeah, man, to the other team. Oh, yeah. That's a huge problem. No, yeah. no that's over. Yeah, no, no, it's, there's no advantage. It's over. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. If, 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 you know that's what Jamal Murray goes nowadays. down. That's a huge. That's a huge problem. That's what oh, yeah. are about nowadays. Is that if one star player go down, it changed mm -hmm. the whole atmosphere of everything. Yep. 
The only team, the only team I think that can that can weather the storm a little bit would be Boston because they, I think they can still win without Tatum. Yeah, Boston is trash, man. Get the fuck out of here. No, I'm saying they can I don't still think win. they beat I'm Milwaukee they without win Tatum. I, I don't. They, they, don't they don't beat Milwaukee oh, without wait, Tatum. Wait, wait, wait. No, that's you know why that's not true, bro. Because there's times I've seen Boston in 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 in, in NBA uh, playoff games, mm -hmm. and they got players that's there but not there. I, I look at look They're at look at Boston. Look, I'll, I'll tell you one thing. Look at Boston's record okay. without Tatum in the lineup, and come back to me. Okay. They still don't. Be, no, no, no. That's fine. Regular season, they don't beat I them in the playoffs in the series with with, with against Milwaukee. I'm telling regular you, Tatum season, is. I know this fine. is going to sound weird, but Tatum is overrated, bro. I no, I, I agree. So I agree. Times. Oh yeah, I, I, yeah, facts, facts. Yeah. facts. I said that two years ago. Me and the base both said that. I'm base just really that. starting to pick up on it, bro. I, I, I must admit, if you said it two years ago, I said it two years I, ago. I me and disagreed the with you then, but yeah. now I'm looking at it from the games that I've watched. I agree with it now, man. I never thought about it until recently. I've been watching him and said, yo, this dude is not the dude. Oh, we said it last is, year. Bro. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, uh, Infamous, let me throw something stats, at you, bro. too. Empty stats, bro. Empty calories. Let me throw something at you, Infamous, because you, you Go bring ahead. good news. Go ahead, Playboy. Let me let me tell something at you, Playboy. Oh yeah, I gotta get up on the soapbox for a quick minute, but you I'll let you finish go. Okay, okay. Yeah, you gotta get up on that, man, because I love that, but check it out. Jalen mm -hmm. Brown, right? You know Jalen Brown is what? How old is he? Mm, uh, I think probably like around twenty seven. Yeah, twenty around twenty six, twenty seven. I can I can look him up. You can look, look him up. up. Go ahead, yeah. Let me see if I can. Because I believe Jalen Brown is about 23. 23? No, I think he's a bit, I think he's older than that. Well, go ahead. Let's Look see. it up. Let me know because I might be wrong. Sure. Let's see. If I can get my thing going here. Pause. Yeah, pause like a mug. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga LeFond said pause kind of how kind of how Dor should pause on his bets. Damn. Oh, he won't go. Hey, go Mike, make him make him another bet, man. See if he go for another one. He already he already he already took it. He said he's saying he's gonna take it. Yeah, you just winning money off this nigga, man. That's crazy. I ain't go I ain't go I ain't go lie to you, man. If I knew Doris sooner, like I told y'all, I'd have been rich. Okay, so he was born in 1996. So 96 will be, will it be 20, 20, where's my math? 27. Oh, he's 20, 27, 26, 27, 27. Yeah, he's 27. Okay. And you know, he had that baby by that girl that she's 29 or 30. Oh, I didn't know that. No, I didn't know. I didn't even know. Yeah. He, is he married? No, they're not married. Oh, okay. Look mm -hmm. it up. Jalen Brown had that baby by that girl. Look, you you can look that up. I'll look it up later. I'll look it up later. Yeah, look it yeah, up. Yeah, so later. he's 20, 27. So you, what was the point you were making? You were making a point about it? Oh, you didn't catch my point yet? No, I was, I'm trying to figure out what your point was. My point was is that he get, he got with a woman that he's actually not with, and they had sex. Because uh, we gotta watch the S word. Oh, my bad, my uh, bad, my bad, my bad. Yeah. He went to the X word, and he delivered to her like she wanted, because when she. Oh man, y'all come. He he delivered to her, and then you know what? He he got her pregnant. Okay. So guess what that means for her? Now I'm good for life. Oh, okay. I see where you're going. You see where I'm going? I see. So his this is this girl is this girl a groupie? Uh no, she's not a groupie. His she's not a groupie. Okay. Let's be careful with that G word. Oh my God! Oh, groupies bad. Think we were saying this motherfucker. Let's be careful with that oh. G word. That's too crazy. 
We got well, we, we got to we 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 have okay, to get the okay, we, we have okay, to get the stream okay. calmed down so Okay, okay, okay. Is okay, she okay. so let me rephrase it. Is she uh 304? Yeah. Oh, okay. Eh, she her age is older. Mm. So this was a distributor on, on YouTube where some YouTubers were talking about it and I investigated and found out it was true. So he he's um, caught up. He's caught up now. Can I can I can I ask you a question? Does he participate in certain um adult movies? Is she one of those kind? No. Oh, okay. No. Not like uh what's his name? I can't think of his name. Uh play for the New Orleans Saints. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. What's that dude name? No, it ain't like that. Yeah, uh, Zion. Zion. Yeah, Zion. It ain't like that. It ain't, it ain't oh, like it's not that. a Zion case. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, you. it ain't like Zion. I mean, man, it's to each his own, I guess. I mean, I can't. Hey, I wouldn't do it, but hey. Yeah. No, no, no. But see, to me, mm-hmm. man, listen, if you're going to do that, then that's the woman you should marry. Because the standards of old times, they still stand strong. But at the same mm-hmm. time, we got too many people out here, man, having kids that ain't got a daddy. I look at it this way. I look at it this way, uh, Fonz. If you, we have right. a lot of people out here having kids, but they can't take care, take care of the kid. But if right. a person is able to take care of the kid, I have no problem with it. The problem well, is the people who are seen, having kids uh, can't take care of them. How <laughs> I many have you That's seen the major, do that? No, but he's an NBA player, bro. He can take care. He's gonna. He he has the financial worth all to take care of the child. Take care of the you know child. Yeah, because he has the money, though, don't, don't mean he's gonna get that mentally, physically, and all that. And all. I, I do agree. I, I do but agree. I'm saying, but I'm saying, there's an echo, man. There's an echo, man. Wait, wait. That, I don't know if it's me. I'll be coming. I don't know if it's me. Is that me? No, I ain't getting. Go no, ahead. No, you I ain't getting. Go ahead. You Texas. It's Oh, hold on. Oh. Hello, 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 hello. Is there still an echo? Yeah. It's me. I, I'll, I'll, it's I'll, me. Come I'll, I'll, I'll come out. I'll come out. I'll come, come, out, out, and come, out, and come out. I'll come out. Hold on. Is there an echo now? Nope. The echo no. is when, 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 when I hear from this talk, the echo is no echo. There's no echo uh, debate in uh, Alfonso? No? Alfonso, the echo is the echo. Am I echoing? Am I echoing? <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know who it is. Every, I, I just came back in, so I don't, I don't know. I don't hear anything. No, you're fine no, when you're you fine talk. When you talk. The echo now the is echo when now I talk. I can hear the echo. I can hear the echo. Is that, is that me though? No, the base speak. Not you, not you. Okay, I don't know. It's, 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 when, it's, I it's when I talk. I don't hear anything. Yeah, NBA players are dumb when it comes to who they pick and how many kids they have, and so are NFL players. I prefer um, baseball players. They're the, they're the smartest, like amongst the three sports. They get good wives. Like Marcus Simeon's wife, I think she might be legit good, man. That, that, that would be my dream woman. Right there, boy. Right there, boy. She's pretty too. She's six, she's like six four as well. I mean, I ain't talking no more. Exactly. 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 Who is not echoing? Yeah, I don't yeah. know. I'm. I don't know. know. I'm is it me? Is it me? Go out and come back in. Is it me? Try to try to go out and come back in. Is it still echoing? Yeah, even yeah, when Mike, even talk when is Mike talk is echoing. That could be me. I don't know. I just came in. I'll, I'll, I'll come. I'll no, come back no, in just because. When you talk, it don't echo. Is this true, Mike? I'm gonna come back in. Okay. I'm gonna come back in, man. Go ahead, Tizzy. Yeah, I don't know who that is. Yeah, I don't know. Hold on, I'm gonna come back in. I don't know. This effing phone, man. My phone is. Do y'all want me to go out and come back in? Come back in. Yeah, 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 try that and yeah, see. Try that and see. Okay, okay. 
Oh my glass. Babe. Here. Go ahead. Go ahead, Lafonso. Yeah, I'm going. Hold on. Push that button real on the right hand side. Red button. That takes you out. Push it. Come babe. Mm-hmm. Okay, now. Uh, you have to reset the phone. Dave, how are you? I'm good. And it's just talk to you. I, I don't do you like you do me. You just go out and say you don't talk to me. You want to go lay down? Yeah, I'm going to soon. So we'll have to start the phone over. You got to reset it. That takes away the echo. Look, I just came in and is it, can anyone hear me? Is there an echo? Nope, no echo. All right. Every now and then my phone will echo, but uh, I guess that wasn't me to this, this time. But yeah, in the past, it, it would do that. I don't know what, I guess after, after a while, that's what happens to people to people's devices. The device started doing some adjuncts. So they all left. Infamous is gone. Debate. <laughs> base the base fell out. Infamous fell out. <laughs> I ain't held it today, man. I had two salads today. I had a watermelon, man. I had um smoothies. I just gotta drink plenty of water now. Damn, what kind of salad do you eat? Nah, I just, just just lettuce with Thousand Island Island dressing, but um, I also had a little bit of cilantro. <laughs> that that's pretty good too. Y'all don't y'all don't know part no parsley. No, I didn't buy any parsley. No. I think I'm gonna eat another salad. I don't know. Thousand island, thousand calories? No. A thousand island dressing is delicious. <laughs> they put that on some sandwiches. I think I me, mean, I, I ate it with my on my salad, but that's delicious. Man, I mean, thousand dollars is a really good dressing, man. Mm-hmm. You put that on a burger. That's that's the best condiment to me, man. Thousand Island, uh, and then um, I, I still like honey mustard, and then ketchup with fries. Yeah, what, I, what you? No, nah, I I like the, either the uh, crinkle fries or I like the uh, just. Just the regular fries. Well, I'm not big. What, what you, yeah. you gonna ask me? You gonna ask me something? Who? 
What? Um, I don't know. No. My I my dressing is easily thousand dollar a ranch. Those two me are just top dog. Oh, and I like what you call blue cheese, man. Oof. But I you can, I can yeah. Maybe yeah. put that blue cheese on there for some croutons. I ain't saying a lot of croutons, but just a little bit of croutons. Uh huh. A little bit of meat. Gotta have some meat. Oh, I was gonna ask you. I was gonna say, uh, what, what do you know about the taquitos with the sour cream? I had that last night, man. I'm gonna eat that again. <sighs> yeah, man. That sounds like some. That like something I need to try. Sour cream is. Oh, that's good too. I like sour cream. <laughs> yeah, we could do sour cream. But I don't eat much processed food. I try not to. I try to eat more organic. I'm eating strictly healthy and again. In March, I kind of got away. Well, um, well, the beginning of the part of this month, I got away from it. But um, I'm back to eating healthy. Oh, man. Yeah. Uh. What else eat healthy? Uh, cute combos with dressing is good too. Mm, yeah. Wait, is the farmer coming back on? I don't know, probably not. <clears throat> Yeah, the final fell out twice now. Yeah. Um, the been I'm just, just, uh, for, uh, what? I'm just ready for the playoffs. I, at this point, I don't really care about these this last one game or whatever. It's I'm just ready to see some of these teams play and get it going. And the Astros, it's going to be a long season for Houston, man. They went 4-11 and tonight. It sucks to see them struggle, but it's going to be one of those years for them. Rangers beat them. The Rangers are 8-6. They still have blow. Huh? What would you say? Oh, you, call, oh, you called them? Yes, yeah, so I kind of – one of our calls, it knocked me out of the stream. Oh, uh, but that, that's his voicemail. Or that hit him. What? Yeah, nah, that's his voicemail, huh? Yeah, the, when we write the voicemail, your your idea of nutrition sucks, Gene. I think you need to rewrite your name and what you stand for. Uh, <laughs> that's that. Uh, I'm pretty fit. Uh, I would say I would say I'm, I'm in the I'm in the best shape I've been in in a very long time. I haven't been in, in all time great shape in a, in a minute, but a matter of fact, since you are talking crap, I am going to hit a little bit of a workout. But I have been, I have been getting in pretty good, uh, pretty good top tier shape for a while. But I didn't do it overnight. It took me years of repping. I don't really get. I don't really. I don't really start seeing results until like year five. Year five of training, but I've been putting in some work. When I be at work and I be moving and shit, well, customers be like, "Damn!" Yeah, I watch some of the UFC tomorrow. The UFC. Um, I might watch this. I might just watch one fight. The, the main event fight. None of these fights are worth betting on now. It's it's, it's like betting on stuff now. Is way way more dangerous because person is both the person or team that you think is or is supposed to win usually does not win. 
No, for me they do. I mean, I I, I lost yeah, some, but I mean, especially for most most people who who bet, you know, they'll say, "Oh, this guy gonna win." No, this guy gonna win. Like everybody thought Spence was gonna win. He's so weird. Uh -huh. Everybody thought the Ravens were gonna beat Chiefs. Look what happened. Uh -huh. Same with the Niners. So it's like it's like betting on stuff now. If you don't know what you're doing at a high level, like you do, in Texas, you can really put yourself over. Well, I just try to look like the trends and stuff, and I look at the storyline, and, and I do look at, of course, the team, but. It just made right. sense for the Chiefs to win it this year. <laughs> so, yeah, and uh, that's what people don't do when they make bets. They don't look at all the, all the details, top to bottom, and you end up like mm -hmm. doors. You know, you end up paying niggas. We should be paying yourself. Mm-hmm. When you lose bets over and over and over, it tells you that you should probably stop. It's like it's like a life technique. If I try to fight somebody and I get my ass knocked out, I need to stop with the fight. It, it, at some point, when do you say enough's enough? Your nose broken, yeah. your face broken, you know what I'm saying? Your teeth broken, but you still want to fight. No, you gotta back down at some point. Mm -hmm. I've never, I've lost fights, but I've, I've never had fights I lost back to back. Yeah. Which is good. I might have one here and there, but it's not consistent, which which, which I fuck with. You know, you don't want to. But staying in shape is it's hard, man. It takes, it takes years of dedication. It takes years of repping. It takes being consistent. Mm. <laughs> They're not consistent. And it, it's hard to be consistent. That's not some easy. That's not easy to do. It's easy to work out, but it's hard to do it consistently. Yeah. And you know, eating salads. You know what I mean? Getting your calcium. I think getting your calcium is a big part of it. Getting your calcium, your potassium, all that is huge. When you come out with no. Uh huh. Which, I do a lot of calcium stuff. I do a lot of like calisthenics, uh, a lot of hit workouts. I basically do a lot, do a whole lot, whole lot of uh, LeBron workouts are the best to me. Hit workout, mm -hmm. I'm huge. Yeah. Yep. I do LeBron rope his rope routine. That shit hard as fuck. Yeah. That shit look easy, but try doing that for five minutes straight. Shit. Your whole arm will be burning. I don't know how LeBron be doing. He be doing that shit 30 minutes. And making it look easy. That's what made, that's made LeBron so great in Texas. The mm. fact that he can dominate these young people is over yeah. stage. Like that play did, did, did at the Grizzlies game. I don't know if you saw it, Texas. No, I didn't but watch it. the way it. he just that steal and dunk like that, outrunning these youngsters, that's crazy. I show you a lot, but a whole lot about LeBron and his nutrition, his training. He takes it serious, and everybody's saying that Jordan's saying can't transfer with, with LeBron. Shit, I love Jordan. I love Kobe, but man, that man, that man, man, man LeBron. When it comes to that's the one knock on Kobe Bryant. He didn't take care of his body well. Mm -hmm. That's not one for him, and he shot yeah. too much. Yep. Yeah, I think Kobe over. They said they said I didn't make this up. He overworked himself, and uh, but he, like you said, he wasn't taking care of his body like LeBron. But also, LeBron is also has blessed blessed genetics, and all that is what hurt Kobe. <laughs> I guess he's working out. Yeah. That's really what hurt uh I really what hurt Kobe Bryant, man. Going too much. 
And that's what, and, and and the one thing LeBron said about his training, he said the number one thing on this list is that he he believed in sleeping. So LeBron does train hard, but he sleeps well, which helps his body recover. He don't overtrain, he don't undertrain. Yeah. And that's why he's playing at this age. If you watch uh, MJ and Kobe, they 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 train themselves so hard, they didn't rest very much. Yep. Which is why they got hurt. And then LeBron, you know, LeBron has the benefit of advanced technology, e even as a I mean, even as opposed to Kobe, because Kobe in those two thousands, and even even like early 2010, 2010 11 is not the same as twenty twenty four. You know. And that helped LeBron. Yep. I wish I, I wish I could be. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I wish that uh, uh, I wish that I knew what LeBron do for Vadim. Pretty steady his training. Cause because LeBron be saying he said get more. I didn't hear that you cut in and out. Wait, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. I said, uh, he said he's, he said he's getting ready to come back on. Um, okay. Recovery is just as important as training, yes. And uh, Texas, uh, I'm going to have to watch LeBron's. A training session and try to get on his level. Yeah, for real. I ain't saying I'm going to the NBA, but just his training alone, along with his recovery, like he does ice baths. They say he's sleeping in ice chambers and shit. Oh, chamber. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the bronze playing for the Heat, the way he was moving and shit, at his size. And they said he spends two million dollars on his body every year, and that's what they've been saying. I don't know. How, well, I, 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 I don't know, but he's I can believe, I can believe it. it. All the stretching he sessions has. and the massage sessions, and that body the chamber is probably a couple thousand by itself. He's a nutritionist, you know, he's chef. He got chefs. He got more than one chef. That's what's crazy. Mm-hmm. You got like four chefs. That's that's a boss right there. You got like four or five chefs in the um in the um in, in the kitchen at one time. <laughs> yeah, so they got his diet on point. It should it should just right. Yep. <laughs> And LeBron's elite, man, his ability to just outrun everybody in front of him at this part of his career, it just tells you how dangerous he was in his prime. Mm -hmm. I think people can say, oh, longevity is going to – that people want to cut out. You know, so let's say LeBron retires and he plays three more years, which I think he will. Let's say he retires in 2027. They're going to just, okay, say 24 years old. Oh, but they're going to try to take away 10 of those years to try to say, well, Jordan played 13, 14, or whatever, te technical years, and because, you know, he took time off. But longevity is a part of a career. You can't just cut out a whole decade of a man's career because that other dude decided to leave early and then come back. That's not – like, if you think Jordan is a better player, fine. But when we talk about the GOAT, like – Everything is involved at that point. Your skill, your skill set, your career, numbers, accolades, which Jordan has a lot of those, but so does LeBron. But also LeBron being the all-time scoring champion, that has to matter. That has to matter. And you can say, oh, this is longevity, but it still happened. Yep. People ignore facts like that. I remember Jester saying last night about Angel Reese, and I, I have no problem, man. Um, I don't have a problem with her talking some crap because it's competition. I mean, you know what I'm saying? I mean, is she probably arrogant? Yeah. 
I mean, that's probably why some of the media didn't, media didn't like her. I, and I understand how they see it. Personally, it doesn't bother me. But he was a jester with – Oh, no, for Juju Watkins, says stats don't tell it all. But then that's all you use against LeBron James to, to indict LeBron, to criticize LeBron. So people just want to they want to they want to switch logic and apply it whenever they want to apply it. And that's not how you do it. So. Yep. And that's what he did last night when he talked about the one girl that shot over 20 times. We've got 20 some points. 27. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, and then all of a sudden, yeah. It's not, it's not an excuse to take that many shots. If you're taking 20 shots, you better have you better have 70 plus the points. 22, they say 22. I didn't look at the average, the average 27. I mean, you, you're, you're taking as many shots as you, the points that you're making. <laughs> To just about. Yes, that means that you know other shots can. Um, but I'll say this though, because now, well, I'm not. I don't know. I don't know. You said Lafonso's coming back on. He said. Yep, I'm about to actually hit him again. Mm. He did so well. AC's probably over there doing his door door dash. Probably, probably getting. Hey, he might he might do with that snow bunny. Hey, LeFond, are you pulling up? Yeah, I'm, I'm getting back on. I'm gonna get back on right now. I ain't free. I'm getting back on. You, you, yo, send me a link. It's easier. Thank oh, you. Okay. I'll be right back on. All right, I'm, I'm sending it now. Send me that link. All right, then. All right, I'm sending it right now. All right, late. All right, late. And she's probably with that snow bunny. Trying to... That's fine, man. Just turn away from her after you do that one time, sir. I'm just trolling. I don't know what she's doing. None of my Let business. The Bronco, the Bronco work pads. Just hating. It's not good to hate. It's probably that guy pagan, uh, maybe. Yeah, it is pagan. I don't, I don't care, but like, cause though, uh, cause pagan said, "Oh, hey, I got a lot of my picks right, sir." You want Adesanya, the Chiefs, and the Ravens, which I had the Ravens winning, but I had the AFC Championship Chiefs Ravens. Many people thought other teams. I had the Rangers went uh, going to LCS last year. I had the Astros going all the way the year before. I had, um, man, I mean, what else happened? I mean, me and Mike both agreed that the Warriors, they, I said, somebody said the Rockets. I was like, there's no way that the Warriors are not going to make the play, uh, place to play in to play LeBron James, and here we are. And then I called it early last month. Mavericks are going to play the Clippers. Even Dante said the same. He said, yep, I heard him say it. I said that. And, you know, and what else? I mean, there's a lot of other things, man. Me and Mike both knew the Warriors were not going to lose to the Magic, which the Magic are actually pretty good this year, but we knew that wasn't going to happen. And what happened? Everybody said, Gold State, oh, they're struggling. Uh oh, they can't make it. Man, come on. What happened? Anybody who watched basketball should know this stuff by now. I, I caught Izzy knocking out Alex Pereira, who's going to fight tomorrow against Jamal Hill. And I. And Everybody said Pereira's going to knock out uh, Izzy because Izzy's not even a knockout artist. And I said, I think he'll knock him out. He did. He did. It was, it was exactly a year ago. He did. He knocked him out. Yep. Yep. I don't know the odds on Izzy knocking him out, but they were very, 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 very unfavorable. Oh, oh I, I even called when the Rangers were playing like uh, in the playoffs how they were going to beat. And Eric knew Eric was Eric knows this how they were gonna beat up the uh the Orioles in the race and it played out that same exact way. And I did miss the Lakers pick uh last year against the Nuggets, but hey, I'll take the loss in the Western Conference Finals.
I, I, I said I got the Yankees going to the ALCS this year. I'm not going to back away from that. And nobody had much faith in the Yankees. Even Random was like, are you, are you serious? Mm. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah, a lot of people want stuff, man. A lot of this shit you can call off, you can call from all the way. It don't take a rocket science. You gotta open your eyes. What the heck is that? A lot of people's eyes are closed, so. Yep. God, dog, I need to take this out. Three, four, five, one, two, three, four. Young goat. Uh, so, yeah, I know Infamous said the pet. You say what? I know Infamous was saying a week, week and a half ago or two weeks ago the Pelicans uh, look, look like they could be a problem, I believe. And he said that, and heck no. I could be wrong, but I just don't see it, man. I'm, I'm ready for the playoffs, and I wish they started today. But a lot, of the, a, lot of these, a lot of these things, when you watch it and you look at it in totality, you wouldn't, you wouldn't believe it. The Pelicans aren't as good as, as he think they were, thought they were. They don't even look that good, to be honest. Like not, not like he was talking about. Mm -hmm. They don't look good like that. Nope. I'm not a believer in the Timberwolves either. Yeah, their fate. 
I think things can be a problem, but like I said, their their game consists of a lot of, you know, ISO ball. They they can move the ball too, but um, I'm still afraid what will happen to them in the in, in the interior. I know they had Nurkic, and I, I like Nurkic. I like them in Portland, but. Yeah, Nurkic was a uh, he was the first team. Matter of fact, I'm about to do two things. I'm gonna be right back, Texas. I'm about to do two things really fast.
Okay. Finally. Oh. Finally, finally, finally. Uh. When LeBron was lethal in his prime, everybody forget how good he was in his prime. The way he could jump and run and just physically strong. LeBron really could have played football if you really put it in context. Like his level of strength is, is incredible. The nick, the nigga LeBron, he big, but he built like a, he built like an in shape tight end, or de defensive end. Once he hits you with that elbow, it's over. Just ask, just ask Stewart. The nigga LeBron hit with that elbow. Raps. Yeah. Once you hit you one of those, be like, damn. Yep. Yeah. Take no ain't lying about that. Man, hit you with an elbow, it's over. They suspended LeBron. LeBron hit that one boy with an elbow. They suspended him how many games? Was it, I don't know, was it three? Five? I don't know. What is it? I don't know. Three games, like two or three games. Mm -hmm. So if they spend LeBron for hitting with elbows, what that tell you about LeBron's physical strength? If LeBron really wanted to, he could just he could just elbow niggas out the fucking way if he really wanted to. He can come mm -hmm. out of court every time and pull like Shaq. But the referees be calling a foul on LeBron. So LeBron's not I don't believe LeBron's using his full strength when he goes to the rim because he knows if he does that, he could hurt somebody. And LeBron mm -hmm. the, LeBron's the kind of player he don't want to hurt nobody. Yep. And they're saying LeBron couldn't play in the era of Jordan era. Man, stop it. You put LeBron in the era where LeBron can actually elbow niggas? Shit. And what they're not taking into context <laughs> is that yeah, LeBron's playing in a softer era, but it was still kind of physical in like the two mid to the late 2000s. And the, you know, Boston, was it Boston? No, the Wizards. They were hacking the crap out of LeBron. And he was still overpowering dudes. So if you take a LeBron that at his biggest at 260 and put him in that era where he can, a lot of those guys weren't as big as LeBron. And, and you're telling me LeBron has shown that he can take physicality, but you put him in that era where he can actually use all of his size, yeah, they will be in trouble. And they want to, see, it's, this, this is it's what I'm saying. It's just hate because they say LeBron couldn't play in that era, but you have to understand. LeBron is, is adapting to the way of the league. So when they say he flopped, when he used to flop, they say he's only playing to to help himself and his team to to uh, you know to flop and and to you know what I'm saying like stuff like that. But if LeBron grew, see what they don't understand is if LeBron grew up in that era where he had to be a certain way, he could he would definitely be able to do it. Like I don't know. I don't know how a bunch of grown men can hate another man like they that. Say, they, they, they say LeBron can adapt to those rules, but Jordan can adapt to these rules. Mm-hmm. 
LeBron, you, you like you said, LeBron has to flop in this era because that, mm -hmm. it's 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 the world of the game now. But back then, mm -hmm. like you said, if you play in the other era, he would play more tougher. Because that era, you had to be tough in that era. And LeBron was getting hacked against the Wizards in that, in that playoffs. And even in Detroit, where it was still physical to a degree. I'm not saying, you know, and LeBron wasn't complaining. LeBron was still giving them 40 pieces and stuff. So, <laughs> I don't know what they're talking about, but it is what it is, man. LeBron, LeBron's usually a top five most physical player of all time. Mm-hmm. And we haven't LeBron. seen. Is it what? I'm saying in that era, there was nobody like LeBron James with the entire package. So his, his speed, his height, I mean, uh, weight, size, strength. Imagine if LeBron started in this era instead of that era. Mm -hmm. And a lot of those bigs were not skilled. This is called for what it was, man. They were just big stiffs that just. Play super, try to play really what they call physical. What it, it, it wasn't even, I mean, it, it was physical, but it wasn't like they make it out to be. Like, it was just this, oh my god, it was just crazy. <laughs> but if, but if, but if, but if LeBron could dominate that era, if you put Prime LeBron in this era, who's stopping him? Mm -hmm. No one, they couldn't even stop him then. Okay. Mm -hmm. Because in, in in LeBron's prime, they had they had more guys that played defense. Mm -hmm. They had better coaches. Now in this league, you got worse coaches. You got not not many teams play take pride in defense. So imagine LeBron, and LeBron. If if this old LeBron can average twenty five on these young cats, what is he doing in, in his prime in this era? He's averaging 35, 40 easy. Mm -hmm. He's going to the rim with no resistance. Yep. Guys, if, if Tony Allen couldn't stop LeBron, if Dwight Howard and all niggas couldn't stop LeBron, what is what is guys like Gobert and Towns doing? What is Jokic doing? What is Giannis doing? Mm -hmm. KP? Nothing. He would dominate oh, by himself. Second stint, Cleveland Cavalier and uh, Miami Heat LeBron, they were in the finals. This year, at least three times in a row. You got to think who's guarding him now. You're gonna have either mm -hmm. the Nuggets try to guard him, the Bucks, teams like that, Boston, Golden State. I don't see anybody from this time frame holding the prime LeBron James. Mm -mm. They can't hold him now. Yep. He's down here doing fast break reverse dunks. Kevin Garnett said he might he could play five more years if he wanted to. It's, it's true, but he he'll probably play three more years. The only the only thing the only thing the only thing that could change LeBron mind is if he wanted to. Mm-hmm. I feel like with LeBron won the chip, that might convince him to go four or more. Yeah. But the, but the way AD you play, but the way that AD plays, that's hard to see. Mm-hmm. It's hard. It's hard to see LeBron. I could see him winning, but then I then I could see AD fucking him over too. Yep. I'm not throwing up a big game. Or D Lo fuck it up with zero points. Shit like that. Reason yep. I'm him and shit. Nah man. <laughs> That's crazy. He's I'm only him. doing that because because he hears people hyping him up. That's the reason. Call him Hillbilly Kobe. That's just terrible. Comparing him to Kobe is just disrespectful because Kobe Bryant took part in defense. 
which Reeves does not. Kobe, Kobe Reeves don't get two fucks about defense. Yeah, and Kobe could attack the rim at will. Kobe had a real jump shot and handles. Mm hmm. And he actually was him. Yeah. D Lo, D -Lo was him him before AR. Well, that's true, but 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 have you noticed since Gabe Vincent came back, the mm -hmm. deal's kind of falling off. <laughs> yeah, that's a problem. Cause there's some nights where Delo looks like a legit star. Some night, I said some. We can't have Gabe and Delo playing bad. One of them gotta play big. Mm -hmm. It don't gotta be. It don't gotta be Delo every night. But every night we need one guy outside of LeBron and AD to go crazy. At least one or two guys. It could be anybody. It could be Christie and Calston, far as I know. Just as long as it's two other guys. Torian Prince might go off one night. Hachimor might go off one night. All we need is two guys. Not name LeBron and AD to go off. Nope. Whoever those two gonna be, Texas, we don't know. Mm -hmm. But everybody's saying that Delo has to be the guy to go off. No, he don't. We just need two role players out of the stars to go off. That could be Delo, it could be Reeves, it could be Torian Prince, it could be Cam Reddish. I mean, just just somebody not named the star. We need two little guys to show up. Yep. I'm gonna be dealing Reeves every night. It might be Hayes one night. Shit, he might come in the fuck thing and get 15 and 15. Yep. But George is love handing out money, man. Shane. Boston ain't, Boston ain't as athletic as it used to be. Getting rid of Robert, Robert Williams, that was a bad decision. Because he, he's fast for big, and he's also mm -hmm. athletic. So even if he yep. gets beat, he can use the athletic ability to recover. But he went to A and M. No, I just said he went to A and M. I remember him. Yeah, but Texas, if you beat KP off the, off the dribble, can he recover? No. He's too slow. Yep. Yeah, nope. Nope. So you replace an athletic dude. With a hey Texas, that's like replacing uh an athletic dude with goat Mike in, in, in center. You can't do that. I just think I don't know if they were thinking they were probably thinking we wanted to get more offense, but uh I don't know. I mean you could say he spaces the floor better, but uh, I mean I don't know. Um I think because they didn't want to be too reliant upon their two guys, but I have no faith in Boston. But you got to think, you already got enough offense. You got Drew Holiday. Mm -hmm. You got Derek White. Mm -hmm. Pritchard. Pritchard. Yeah. How, yeah. I mean, how, I how, and then, of course, you got the two dudes. Yeah. Of course, you got. Yeah. Derek White was good at Colorado. You got to have some defense. Having Will on the court would benefit them more because he can get beat and still recover. And he can also go hard pick and roll to some degree. But they did get that. I mean, they got that big man from that came from Memphis. Um, but at home, Tillman? I don't know. Tillman, yeah, Tillman's uh, slow footed Tillman. too. Yep. He's slow. <laughs> Once you go past him, it's a wrap. He ain't about to block your shit. See, and Williams played a big role in, uh, for for them in two years ago for the Celtics. 
Yes, yeah, Spe- he specifically. Yeah. yeah. He played a huge role. His his ability to get back into playing with his athletic ability and just block you, that's huge. Mm-hmm. Look at all the they biggest drop. blocks, Texas. All the biggest blocks came out for what? Dudes that can jump and run. Yep. The fact that you replaced Williams with KP, you got worse defensively but better on offense. Yep. The ball said offense ain't the problem. The inability mm-hmm. to guard when it matters is the problem. And Boston used to be a team known for defense. Mm-hmm. You're damn right. For many years. Back then, for back then it was hard to score on, on Boston. Mm-hmm. You can't even get to the damn round. Mm, yeah. Then you couldn't shoot. Now I guess Boston. Back then, Boston was known for a grit and grind. It's going to beat you up. That's why, I like old, that's why I like that old Mem- Mem- Memphis team, man. Because I remember, I remember everybody was saying two years ago, oh, yeah, we like the old grid and grind Grizz- Grizzlies, but this one is different, though. Um, which I agree, which I know that Morant got hurt and that turned it around. But I like that. I like the old Grizzlies with Mike Conley, Gasol, T- Randolph. Randolph was money. Like, and then you had OJ Mayo, you had Rudy Gay, woo, you had uh, Courtney. I don't know if Courtney Lee was on the team those years, but I know I know he was around 2015, but you had we well, had Tony Allen, you had all these dudes. So but they just could never get past the second round, man. And the Spurs used to always beat them. They finally beat the Spurs. It was it twenty fourteen or fifteen? They finally beat the Spurs, but then they got bounced at that second round, man. Yep. Zebo got shut down in round two. They, they shut him down. Who did they play? I mean, they lost the Warriors before, but yeah, 2014, I don't know who they played in the second round because they, they you, you know, they were always losing the second round every year. Zebo looked so good in the first round every year, but in the second round, he needed to get closed off. And Mike Conley was, that was back in the day when Mike Conley, man, was pretty good, man, with that left. Lefty three, and he wasn't really a guy that would attack the rim constantly. He, he would probe the lane or just put up a floater, teardrop, but it would go in though. Head probe the lane. Hey, think you gonna do a floater? And he dumped it off of that pass. Mm hmm. He's sneaky with it. I miss those Grizzlies. And Debo was tough. I ain't gonna lie to you. Between Debo and uh, not I mean, not Debo, I mean, uh, Debo and uh, Demarcus Cousins, when they were in their prime, mm-hmm. could you imagine Demarcus Cousins and Debo in this era? Boy, who is checking these niggas? They kind of had a similar game that, to me. To me. To me, I mean, they were like you said. I mean, they were able to that low block. They can um, do anything around a low block, or they could shoot the midi from the from the side, or they could uh, hit the three. They could they could trail the point guard and catch it in stride, knock down. They could yeah. rebound. They were built a little similar, but what's his name was a little bit heavier. Um, Cousins. Yeah, yeah. Cousins was bigger. You think Jim Green was with 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 trying to shit on Prime Mark Cousins and Prime uh Debo? Shit. Oh, fighting him. He would if he tried to fight Debo or Demarcus Cousins they prom, they 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 would beat his ass. But you know it's funny though, Demarcus Cousins didn't want any smoke with Zebo. <laughs> Remember that? I don't know who did. Zebo was in his Zebo. face and Cousins was trying to, yeah. Zebo's a fucking dog, for real, for real. Imagine Isn't Jamar Green for, trying yeah. to kill Zebo. Zebo fuck Green up. 
Yeah, yeah, man. Dr not Draymond wouldn't do anything. Just to try to do. He wouldn't try anything because you know Draymond didn't even try anything on LeBron. <laughs> Remember that? He said Rasheed Wallace. Yeah, is he saying Rasheed Wallace isn't being good or being tough? He was both. Rasheed Wallace wasn't tough like Debo. No, 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 no. Yeah. Zebo's another animal. That that dude, bro. Anytime you got the markets cutting scared, you know you got that. But Ben Wallace, man, you should have named Ben Wallace uh, Samurai. <laughs> ben, no, Ben, ben Wallace. Wallace. Ben Wallace. Uh, no, that's a different story. Yeah, you named the wrong Wallace, sir. You, ben Wallace, yes. <laughs> How do you see that Ben Wallace take his in the street? And you gotta fight. And you gotta fight him one on one. <laughs> in his prime because uh he was country strong southern he's southern strong that's the problem man you you see ron artes didn't want that smoke i don't care what anybody says they said ron, ron artes didn't want the smoke with ben wallace because if you ron saw ben wallace Ron was laying on the scoreboard, and then Ben Wallace just started to come. Ben Wallace was looking for a fight. That man, that man, Ron Artis, he went so tough then. Jermaine O'Neal almost knocked out one of those fans, bro, because he caught him, but he slipped, bro. If he had to caught him flush, you go, go back and watch it. Uh, the mouths have the, the palace, bro. That, that would have been a knockout. You got to forget, Taylor, Jermaine O'Neal was a dog, too. He beat you up. Oh yeah! Oh, Jermaine O'Neal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was a yeah. It's pretty. It's pretty intimidating too, because when they were walking in the tunnel, somebody poured good beer on them. I will, well, well, you know, cool Kool Aid, man. And um, dudes were like grabbing his arms to try to keep him calm, man. Just imagine some seven foot monster just, oh, if you are, man. Jermaine O'Neal. Now they had dogs back in the NBA, man. I mean, not even in the nineties. Forget that. I'm saying like the early, the early two thousands, mid two thousands. Ron Artest was a dog too. Like you know, not many guys would want to fight him, but he won no pieces of uh, Ben Wallace. Everybody forgets Ron Artest was big, bro. You know, you know, Ron Artest was six seven two sixty when he played. That's huge. <laughs> I'm not lying. Two sixty. That's what he weighed when he played. <laughs> You know that you know that Shaq didn't want no pieces of uh Big uh Big Ben. Nah, Shaq couldn't even he couldn't even move Big Ben in the paint. He couldn't. Big Ben had to be paint. He couldn't go nowhere. Big Ben would not move. Yeah, that'd be crazy. But Zebo tough man. Hey, Tess, could you imagine Zebo played for the uh for Golden State right now? Bro, but those um, guys shots be wide open. Oh, that Zebo, yeah, they'd have a date. They'd be a contender, a top contender. Prime Zebo in the paint. He's like the monkey's cousin to me. If you ask me, I mean, you could argue he may maybe he's better, maybe he's not. But I mean, they were they were similar. We'll do it right here, Texas. If they put Zebo in his prime at the five, how would that emulate? How would that? How would that do the NBA today? In today's NBA, if Zebo in his prime today's league was at the five for Golden State, and they slid Green to the four, they put Green at the four and Zebo oh, at the five. Oh, they're they're going to the conference finals. I mean, ooh, that'll be tough because, like, if if that were the case, then I, then I'd say the West would be very stacked. See, people say the West is stacked just because of the records and it's close. No, 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 no. Like some of these teams are fugazi to me. But if you put the him on the Warriors team, oh, the Warriors have a legit shot to go to the finals. The Nuggets, the Mavericks. I'm still going to say the Lakers. You can call me crazy, but because right now to me it's a it's a three team race to me, but. 
It'll be a four team. Yeah. I think, I think Zebo could shut down uh, Joker one on one. Yeah, I, I think Zebo would give. He's saying, yeah. saying he was stepping down from shooting. I took no, no. And then Zebo would give him the work. Zebo would see that would be a nightmare for uh, the Nuggets because, or, well, I mean, yeah, because Zebo would give. What's it in the work? Because Zebo would take him out outside as well because he could play outside. Yeah. Take and, and like I said, if you want to beat the Nuggets, to me, one of the things you have to do is be, I said before, I said again, you have to be able to, um, you got to be able to make Jokic have to move defensively and run around, get him tired. And then, and then from that point forward, if you got a guy that can back him down like he can, then it helps. And then on top of that, you, but you need guys that can one on one take the chance to defend because you're not going to be the Nuggets if you don't have guys that are willing to try to commit to the defensive side one on one. And then, of course, you got to play good help defense, but help defense doesn't matter if you can't play any kind of, well, I mean, man defense, unless you're going to just play zone the entire game. You wouldn't, you wouldn't trust uh, putting, putting, uh, Putting Zebo on Jokic and having Jamal Green be the help defender. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, that's different. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. Because if you do I'm, that, I'm, yeah. I'm Zebo on Jokic straight up, and I'm have, I, 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 and I'm gonna have Green play the four as the help. Mm -hmm. Oh man, and that's gonna probably that. Yeah, that's gonna be problems for the Nuggets if hypothetically if that happens. <laughs> how is it? How? how how would the Nuggets be able to get their offense off? Because Green's physical and Zebo's physical. So how do you how do you run your stuff? Because Zebo ain't Zebo ain't gonna get no open screen. And neither is Green. It sucks that it sucks that it sucks that Clay's not what he used to be. Because boy, if you had a and just hypothetically, if you had like a 27, 26, 27 year old Clay Thompson, then man, uh that because he committed to defense. That would be that. That would be straight. Oh, the war, the Warriors might mess around and go to the finals if if, if they if they had a, a, a like a, like Clay was back what he used to be in his mid to late twenties and they had Zebo and they they they'd go to the finals probably. That'd be dangerous. That would give them a dynamic they they never had. If you could throw the ball in the post to uh, Zebo, and if we double team Zebo, man, he ain't got to pass the ball very far. Mm -hmm. And Zebo could pass. It was crazy. Zebo is an underrated passer. So you put yeah, that guy on the team with shooters, man. You can't double him now. So 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 now you got to pick your point there. Are you gonna double or are you gonna play man? And the only reason why Zebo is that what? Oh, I was just saying the reason, the reason why Zebo didn't even have like as as great numbers as he could have. He was good. But I'm just saying that he didn't have. Like monster numbers, like D Cousins had back in the Kings, because he had you know Gasol was there, so you know you got to share the work. But he would have been even crazier. But yeah, I like Zebo. I think Zebo slept on. To be honest with you, I thought he was slept on when he played for Memphis. Zebo ain't had no good shooters like that. If he had real shooters like the Marcus Cousins had, ooh wee. Man, man, his game would open up. You give a yeah. big man like Zebo, who's physical in the paint, shooters, any kind of double team, that's an easy pass every fucking time. That little fadeaway he had at, at the mid-range, he loved that from the side, too. That, that mid-range fadeaway type of, or, you know. No, no, hesit no hesitation. Yeah, he get the ball, your back facing you. Boom, boom, dribble o over the outside shoulder, shoot it. He, he, he wasn't missing that one. That's like Russ. Russ had that unguardable mid-range jump shot with OKC. You remember that? He's coming at you full speed and just, ah. Russ was a terror to guard back in the day because he don't know if he's going to pull up or is he going to go right past you or go right into you. Yeah, that's tough. I ain't gonna lie. And Russ played mad every game, bro. Like, 
and Zebo will be deadly in this in this time frame. Man, could you imagine Mark Gasol or Paul Gasol in their prime in this era? Who is checking these niggas? And I like Mark. I like Mark Gasol more than I like Powell because he was a better passer to me. Mark Gasol, Mark Gasol, and Paul Gasol in this era, I believe they would dominate Joker because you got the mm -hmm. Joker, Joker and. Uh, Joker and Paul Gasol, Mark Gasol, they're all tough because they all like uh, uh, Mark Gasol from, and Paul's from Spain. Mm -hmm. so they play, they play similar ball. They could pass. They all can pass. All three of them could pass. They all three could shoot. They all three were gonna play physical. That's sad. The eighties, yeah. You go ahead. That's that's sad. Eighties punk punk a. Mother effort doesn't. He plays less physical than they play. That's why. Now you see why I say I'll take Marcus All or Paul Gasol over AD because even though they're not as talented as AD, they're tougher than AD. Mm -hmm. And that's and, that, and that's the knock on AD is his lack of toughness. That's what killed me about him. He got mm -hmm. all the skill in the freaking world, but got no heart and no motor. I remember this. They were saying once upon a time could AD become the best player in the league. Everybody forgets that. They were actually saying could he be the best player in the league. They were saying AD was a top three player in the league at one point. AD, AD has the skill to be that. He he has the skill to be the best player in the NBA. The problem is that he don't have the motor to unleash that that skill. You can be scared all you want, but if you're afraid to put it on display, you know what I mean, Ted? It's, it's kind of like you being a good singer, but you're afraid to sing in public. Well, how you gonna how you gonna sign a how you gonna sign a record deal if you can't prove to the producer you, you can you can actually sing on stage and not just in the studio? It's kind of like mm -hmm. that. That's what it is. That's kind of like telling a woman, I'm just saying, oh, I got 10 inches, but but but, but she's like, well, let's see. Oh, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> you turn around because you, know, you, you know you ain't got nowhere near that shit. Yeah, no, you know, and them, no, man knows he's got three. <laughs> I'm just. <laughs> oh, dude, you're not lying. That's like, a, that's like a chick saying, my shit, my shit is tight. But then you look down there, and she loses buck. <laughs> loses the Grand Canyon, boy. <laughs> How you looking like, damn? Oh, that's bad, bro. Like, yeah, I, I, I'm never bad. I better never get married to a woman like that. I'd be like, okay, I know I'm, I know I'm working with something good here, but why is it not doing anything? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then your oh, girl's just over here, just your wife. I want, I want to be respectful, but because I don't want you to say some random chick. But like, let's say your wife is, this is like, see, this is nothing, bro. You're like, man, I'm, I'm thrusting hard. This is just, she's just, you like, and then she's just, just nothing, bro. It's like, you don't feel anything, woman? No, because this is loose as the Gulf of Mexico. <laughs> yeah, that's terrible, man. Yeah. yeah. Man, that's how you dying. Dang, Lafonso just... Well, he probably did something, I guess, with... Uh, I know he has uh, people in his home, so he probably had to tend to that, which is... I understand, man. I understand, boy. Mm. The bass just went out just, just abruptly. Yeah, that was... That'd be crazy. That's like, that's like telling the chick Texas, you know for a fact you can last five rounds, but but by round two you fucking gas. And she's like, "Come on, man, come on, three more rounds." Well, and you're like, "Okay, give me five minutes. No, ten minutes. No an hour. No two hours. Three hours." <laughs> well, see, I can go, I can go two rounds back to back almost like. After the first time, I can go, and then second time, I just need like just a few minutes. Cause you know, especially like in my case, I get married, whatever. It's just like I'm not trying to like be a sin, like sin in that area. But let's just say hypothetically, 
since well I have watched stuff before in the past, but I'm just saying, but um I can go back to back pretty with, with just a few minutes. But that third time I'm gonna I'm gonna need are you there? Nope. Yeah, I'm still here. Mm. I ain't go I ain't go a lot of things if if I can go twenty minutes for two rounds, I feel like I did my job. Yeah, the average session well, it was 2014. I found this out. The average session lasts seven minutes, uh, but 20 minutes. Then that, that yeah. Then I take into account Texas, if that shit is if that shit is bomb, if she hitting if she hitting the fucking spot, Texas, and she hitting the spot good, you gonna want to go longer than seven minutes. Trust me. Well, it's only what your body can take too, because some. You know, is what it is. Some chicks might be better, but I'm just saying, Texas. If 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 if, if, if she if she hitting the spot, Texas, and she really putting it on you, she she hitting the spot so damn good, Texas. You, Texas, you you gonna you gonna forget all about fatigue. You gonna forget about. Mm, uh, nah, you, know, you, you might forget about it, but your dawn won't. Cause it, every, you listen. This is me. This is what I would do. This is what I do. Like if I'm with my wife, you know, with a wife in the future, and this is what I would do. I would um, I would have to be the enforcer, you know, for like ten, around roughly ten minutes, and then because I don't like I don't like those super duper long like actual sessions now. Like foreplay, that's you know, that stuff. If it, that stuff is different, but actual like boogie woogie time, like uh, like. Cause a lot of people get it mi mixed up. Cause they'll add time from when they just foreplay and you know rub and kiss all that stuff. But um, for me, I got to be the enforcer like the first nine to eight to nine minutes, and then once I'm ready to explode like the volcano, I'll just let her you know get on top and do her thing. And then when it when it happens, it happens. <laughs> but, at the, but at the same time. If I can go, man, it, it it all depends on it all it all depends on how much you how much you can take. You right about that, but I'm just saying like if she put it on you, man, it's gonna be kind of easy to forget. Like your shit might not forget, but you gonna forget because the shit is that damn good. And then that's when She's they become the pregnant, spot. and that equals uh, pregnancy, and then that equals pregnancy. Yeah, yeah, because it, it's kind of like you kind of like you're not. You're not gonna see once or twice. You're gonna see a couple times, maybe three, four, five times at that point because she's because she hitting it and she hitting the spot good. You over here, the, the c word is coming out, but but yet because it's so good, you just still, you know, you still getting it. I mean, and I'm so. Uh, going to end up I mean, I'm I'm so into it sometimes to where where uh, at least. Uh, Moving forward, I get I get a wife, and I man, there's probably just like I'll probably, you know, one just just being like win a one position, and then say okay, one side explode like a volcano, then then give me a minute, and we're gonna go to this position. Then once I explode from with like a volcano from that one, they're gonna go with this one, you know. <laughs> It's crazy. But, but here's the one thing, Ted. A lot, a lot of men, a lot of men can't explode that many times and still get up. I can't that many times. Yeah. You got to be able to get up that many times too, because some men, oh, yeah. whenever they explode, they they they, 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 it's over. They ain't got nothing left, nothing left till next next day or the next couple hours. Yeah, fortunately, I'm young, so like I said, I I can go back to back, but but then that third time, I'm gonna have to wait. <laughs> I'm gonna have to reload. Give me like an an hour to really reload, because you know, another thing that people don't know is if you is if you keep trying, you know, go back to back to back. You gotta understand this too. People don't know this because if you don't reload completely, like I'm not just saying, you know. I'm saying where you can like get up to your fullest. Some dudes will be doing it like the third time, and then like it won't, it won't, you won't get as extended as as you normally would. People don't know that. You know what I'm saying? True. 
through that, you want to be you. You want to be able to fully extend because exactly. you, want, you want her to really, you want you want to really put it on her. You Gosh. want to have the same performance every time. If you if you're not able to get fully extended because mm-hmm. you're going too much too fast, okay, your first round might be might be dominant. Even the second, second round. round might be you kind know, of yeah. Well, yeah. D minus yeah. is. Mm-hmm. You're not putting it down as good because you you didn't extend. Because the problem is, is if you let's say you, let's say somebody is a seven, but then because that third time they try to go so hard, it, it's not fully e- extended, and then now, now now you're trying to do it with like a inch and a half less. I'm telling you, that's a lot of people don't know that. They think, oh, I could just reload and I'll be fine. But I don't know about anybody else, but I, you know, once I get married, I want to be fully extended every time. But so I wanna I wanna so, so, so for me if I'm if I'm hitting the chick and she hitting it well I wanna make sure that I can stay extended for at least an hour straight and I'm just no matter how much C words coming out I'm just able to I'm just able to keep extended and that's why people do foreplay too because it, it, it kind of helps with that you know <laughs> get people excited but I don't know. So I don't need a foreplay. If the bitch is at Texas, if the bitch is super bad, she bad, bad, like bad, bad, bad. Bro, I'm gonna, I'm going, I'm going to extend for at least an hour, an hour straight, just, just looking at her. If she bad like that, so I'm telling you, that extension going to be there for at least an hour. I'm about, I'm about, I'm about, I'm about, I'm about at the left wall, the other wall, the back wall, the other side wall, the other wall again. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man. But now I just, I can't, uh, I, don't, I don't really look at them anymore. And it's not because I don't, I hate them. It's just, uh, you already know, I'm, I'm just trying to be, uh, I'm not trying to get tempted to uh, do anything. That's why I have to kind of, not give them any eye contact or even look at them at all. It might sound crazy, but I'm trying. I'd have to go the other way. Uh, Damn. But I, I feel bad for Eric, though, man. You just text the base, or no, you did. A lot of dudes ain't answering. Mm-hmm. Like uh, Lafonso, like he gonna hop on, but he, I think he out of there. I think he out of there and don't know it. He probably had happy time and then went to sleep, most likely. <laughs> No, I'm not saying that he watched the video. I'm saying, you know, I don't blame him because when I get married, like, like when I get married, I'm, there's going to be times where I say, you know what? I want to go hang out with the boys. <laughs> but this girl is calling this boy. <laughs> oh. Drinking enough Kool Aid, I'm telling you. The final sound like he was drinking yeah. Kool Aid tonight. No, yeah, he did. Yeah, that could have been it too. I was drink that Kool Aid. You can tell by how he was talking. Mm-hmm. Well, drink that Kool Aid is over. He ain't about to be doing m- much of anything. You can get you can get high and still be functionable. But once you get drunk, it's over. The base got put in the timeout for for the rest of the night. Um, 
infamous. Um, I think his pizza was burning in the oven. <laughs> Doors is trying to find a way how he can win a bet. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, Texas. The the best way for a black person to go to work is to go to work high. Wait, who do you use text? Who me? Yeah. Well, I got a I got a work chat. I've been chatting with a lot of coworkers. I got a chat of like a oh. hundred people. We all be texting each other. Mm. We, but if you got a manager that talk crazy, you know you, you're gonna have a lot of co. What happened to the about. other manager? What happened to Laura? Oh, he got fired. Got fired. Oh, she got she got fired. Hmm. Hmm. They fired. How old is she now? She's she's thirty seven, right? Is she like thirty? She around the thirty seven range. What they fired, they fired her for? Her they, he said what? I'm oh, go ahead. Go ahead. They just fired her because they, they they said she was she wasn't strict enough. This lady this lady ain't just strict, but she talked. Well, she talked to people. When did they she fire Laura? Like, huh? When did they fire Laura? They said it had something to do with the cash office. But when did they fire her? Or do you know? Oh, uh, I found I found because they they first they transferred her. They transferred mm -hmm. her to another store first. And then somebody was somebody this? getting news. It was a long time uh -huh. ago. Did they transfer her a long time ago? Or was this recent? They transferred her recently. They transferred uh -huh. her. It was like it, it, was, it was about a, about a week ago. They transferred her. Mm. They transferred her to, to to another store around, around the corner. And once that happened, they said that she was doing some things in the cash office. Oh, and they got my funeral. Oh wow! So they she ended up still... so they ended up firing her, and then they brought they brought a new lady in. She crazy. She was stealing she cash. Did. Well, I don't know. I don't know if it was stealing cash because oh, yeah, they, 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 they didn't like specify yeah. like oh she stole something, but they it Handling, yeah. something in the cash office. I mean, you can only uh, guess one or two things. Is it the one you stole something, <laughs> or two you getting freaky in the cash office? Oh my goodness. <laughs> And now we got like, a new ball, so she she bad, bro. This new probably, ball is just as bad as this new ball is just as bad as she is. The only difference is the attitude and yeah, the attitude opposite. and all that. She she probably like, oh my goodness, I've I know I I know that I am, you know I like vegetables, but oh my goodness, I had I just had to just 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 have fun time. Oh my goodness, my name is Laura. I'm so sorry that I got caught doing the boogie woogie. Just let me stop. Man, Laura Sims is missed in Walmart, man. Like she wouldn't she wasn't always nice, but at least she was decent. This new manager? Mm, mm, mm. Oh she she's she probably on Facebook. She, I'm she's probably on Facebook if she's a real if, if what you're saying is real. <laughs> she's probably on Facebook, probably so. <laughs> all, all black people, I believe all black people when they lose when they get fired from somewhere, they go on on social media saying something. That's anybody. But you said she's Hispanic though, so yeah. Yep, she's Hispanic. I could, I mean, you you probably could see her on Facebook if she has one. I, I've never, I, me personally, I've never seen her on social media. I've only, I've only seen her in person, but I wouldn't doubt she would have social media. I wouldn't doubt it. No, nah, I don't. Yeah, yeah, looked, yeah. The way she looked, I don't know when. I, I don't. I don't know one chick as bad as hell that don't got social media of some sort. I don't know what, but I, I, I never heard about her on it. She probably would have an OF account too. And I don't care. I'm just saying because it, man. A lot of them are doing that stuff. Like a lot of these people will have jobs and stuff, and but they end up getting fired as they should. You should. I mean, they want to get mad at that. Listen, you either work here and not ta tarnish our, you know, because, because you know, whatever, or you, you know, or, or you can do that and then there's repercussions. But, well, I don't know. It's up to the job, man, but what they do. But because police officers, that's what happened to her.
but I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't want a police officer having an OF account, and she's and she's supposed to serve and protect because, ooh, I don't know about that. But who cares? Your, your, your mic is chopping. Mike check one two. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, Sam, I'm off now. <laughs> you know what I was saying, Texas? Huh? I don't know what I was saying. Yeah, I forgot. But uh, I'm just ready for and you know, see what happens in the playoffs and. See what oh, else happens. I know, I know what I was saying now. She was doing something in the cash office for like the last two, three years. And they caught her doing something. I don't know what. But everybody at my job is speculating because this, this new boss we got, yeah. her mouth is so bad. So everybody's uh, protesting. They get this new lady fired. She gonna yeah, get beat up. Yeah, I don't think a manager in her position should be hurting a manager, unless there should be like an age limit, maybe yeah, thirty, and he, he, even thirty year olds can, I would imagine, can can still be childish, but twenty one year old, there's no way. Twenty one year old front end manager. Make that make any sense? And she's not smart at all. Whenever you, if if you ever talk to her, bro, she's not smart at all. Like like. The way that she thinks and operates, she makes you uncomfortable, not only physically, but mentally. Yeah. She's the kind of person that you would want to avoid at all costs. She's the kind of person taking show how you show how you think she how you thinking about not coming in. That's how bad her mouth is. It's that bad. I would just start recording. Yeah. And just just record when mm-hmm. she, she won't she won't even know, and then you can build a case against her, against the person, whoever. I but, mean, but the only downfall with that is, is that unless you got great lawyers, there's a shot you can lose that case because all of all of my man, all, all, all of her, all of her. So this lady, her bosses are all sexist. They're all simps. <laughs> all of my managers, they simps to her. Like for example, they they tell me if you want her to be nice, you gotta bow down and get on your knees and do certain stuff for her to treat you certain ways to give you certain hours and basically what I'm saying is all the managers they like like, like I told you Texas, I don't care for it but I'm just saying they do. Uh mm-hmm. she has the curves, the body, the looks, the skin and she got she she she's perfect top to bottom on the outside. But <laughs> on the inside, the inside is what like 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 all her bosses 
whenever they talk to her, they be flirting and making their eyes go certain way. They be like, what am I yeah. trying to say, Texas? They be talking to her like like they like they with her or some shit. And that's and that's a and terrible that look not on cool in the workplace. That's a terrible look on the men, if that's true. So I mean they're all simps. They just 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 stupid. Just, 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 and, think, Texas, just, just, just think if you had a boss, right? And yeah. she a woman woman, right? And, a, yeah. and and her bosses are telling you you should bow down. Get on your knee and kiss her ass to, 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 for, to get her way, get your way with her. What does that tell you? That tell you a motherfucker sin talking like that. That's simple behavior. They have no control, man. Man, man has no control. Managers mm -hmm. got no control mm -hmm. at mm -hmm. all. And they have a sign of paper that said we can't do stuff like that. Yeah, that's, that's a, vi a violation. Yeah, that's a uh -huh. violation. That's a violation to, to be doing that flirting stuff with, you know, man, these men, that's what it is, man. I mean, because I, I put blame on men, too, because, and then what if your dumb butt catches some kind of a case or whatever, or not even that, you know, man, I, yeah, these men are suckers, man. I mean, it's what it is. They put themselves in that position. To say, to say that to somebody? That's crazy. Mm -hmm. Even if I work for a female yeah, manager, yeah. If so I work for a female manager, that's just that's out of pocket. Yeah. If I get a body camera and start recording this shit and vlogging it, but I'm telling you, my job might close down. I need to try to record this shit. I ain't gonna lie. It's crazy. He said Chris Jones, who I saw like a, two weeks ago, whenever, three weeks ago, that he was trying to make a pitch this for Aaron Donald to come sign with the Chiefs. Man, if I'm Aaron Donald, if, if he feels like he can play one more year and try to get him a cheap ring, man, uh, I would do it, but he, he probably won't. Man, it's just a lot of these sports aren't the same. I would do it if I was him. Mm, yeah. I wonder if Eric found himself a woman. Eric, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, after what after what Eric told me, I don't know. I mean, after he told us, I doubt at, I doubt that one hundred percent. At that point, if the if the, if the person walks out like 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 that, then I would just say, you know what, I can buy anything you want. They can turn around real quick. Oh yeah, that'll, that'll change them real quick. That's probably what should have happened. Cause, I mean, hey, he, I mean, you know, I'm not saying him, but I'm saying some some dudes have to kind of do that. You know, I mean, I don't knock. I mean, listen, I I've been tempted in the past to do stuff like that, but I've never done it. So, I think I said the story yesterday. This chick. 
text me to send her cash app for uh, money for gas money and she'll and send my you know where i want to meet or whatever and she'll she'll be on her way i'm like first of all i wasn't gonna do it anyway because like i said i i i still am not tr trying to do that but i'm just telling the story that actually happened in a second even if I were on that time, woman, like, why would I send you fifty dollars or whatever for gas? Because all you got to, because you can easily block block my number or whatever else, and then not show up, which is what that's a scam. Then they and I, I, I told the person, I'm you, you must think I'm a simp, yada 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 yada, yada laughing emoji, yada yada yada, and then you could tell that they got mad in the text. I mean, you know. And you have stuff in your face, man. If you use your head and you follow uh -huh. your heart, you're always going to win in life. A lot of people, a lot of people, they don't follow the heart and they fall into traps. Yeah, if you, if you, if you listen to your heart, spirit, mind, whatever, but and stop listening to what's downstairs, then you'll be a lot better off in life. <laughs> Easy. Yeah, man. See, now she... Now, not me, but if she had told another guy, you know, she had to say, hey, I'll come see you. Just be straight up and just if if, if you're looking to get a money exchange out of services or just go tell him, you know, listen, this is that you're going to charge. I mean, and then may, he might say yes, but man, these I, I'm not I'm not stupid, so I don't fall for that stuff. Yep, yeah, but a lot of people people who is falling for stuff like that. And it's unfortunate. You know, there's just certain things you just you shouldn't fall for. But people unfortunately they don't like to use their brain when you don't use your brain. A lot of times you lose in that regard. Which Texas, you, 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 you're, you're a very smart person, so you understand this stuff, but but Texas, there's so many simps out here, bro. bro I'm telling you, if a dude, Texas, you know how many times uh, yesterday I was with my homeboys at work and they were howling at this chick and because, and because I wouldn't join them, they said, oh, I must be fruity because I wouldn't yeah. look at a chick that had a big booty. Yep. See, that stuff don't bother me anymore. You can you can call me all the ad homonyms and words you want to call me at this point. You you think I'm you think I'm this or that way because I'm not gonna try to stare at you know I'm not. And even back in the day, before I tried to do the right thing, I didn't even really stare at women because it, like four or five years ago, I'm like, why am I staring at her? She she's not she's not giving me any of that. You know what I'm saying? So it's just kind of like mm, okay, I I've seen enough and I've experienced. So it's like. That stuff doesn't move me as much, but it is a temptation when it's been a long time or, you know, that's the only time that it becomes, it's like a temptation, but I, I don't really care, man. Uh, you can call me whatever you want, man, because uh, I, I know why I'm trying to avoid that stuff, but yeah. Yep, you know, and that, that's how it's supposed to be. We have to start blaming men, though. We got to start blaming men for this because um, the only reason why they think they can get away with this when it comes to these dudes is because the dudes normalize it. That's why I say the blame goes to me more on the men that I don't now that I realize because the men are the reason why society is the way it is. I'm being real with you because, like, men ultimately hold the power. So when you, so when you have all these bums who are spoiling the, the these, you know, and then when, once that relationship breaks up, then all of a sudden they want to go, you know, to, to another dude, and somebody like you or whoever else is not going to put up with that stuff. Then guess what? Now, now screw you and all this stuff, and that. But it's because men have have started the cycle. That's the problem. And I'll be honest too. Men, men, I'll be honest, 
this is why men are a problem to in society to a degree as well because men men are the reason let's just keep it a thousand violence wouldn't be around if like men weren't you know i'm just being real now because a lot of times when there's like physical violence it's always a man doing something to a man or even to a woman i have to be honest about that that's you know yeah, I'm still here. Yeah, you preaching. If a woman, yeah. like, see, like, we know that men and women need each other, of course, right? Now, I'll say this, though. If a woman says a lot of issues wouldn't be here if it weren't for men, I, listen, I, I tell you all the time, I, I just speak the truth. Listen, I speak up for men, but I can speak up for women in some cases, too. Like, when a woman says, oh, vi violence will be much lower if uh, men didn't exist. That's a fact. <laughs> That's actually a fact, man. Because how many men do you see wanting to fight another man, wanting to take out another dude? A lot of a lot of wars in this country, in in this world, are because of men. Well, of course we know that you know in the Bible, of course, sometimes the chicks war started because of that. But I'm saying in most cases, wars start because of men not coming to an agreement, and they want to just try to solve it through violence. Let's be honest here. I just got to call a spade a spade, Mike. I got to call a yeah. spade a spade. Just Everybody being honest, bro. Know. Like, I told people, I don't, I'm not biased. I just call things the way I see it, man. And that's one thing that men have to get through their thick skulls. Y'all cre create violence toward each other. And even in cases towards women. You see what I'm saying? Like, you know, like Mike, you, like, 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 like you said, it wasn't violence towards you, but they were like, "Oh, you, you must be, you must be, a, you must be a strawberry, if you know what I mean." Because oh, you're not, you, you, you're not drooling over this, this, you know, this, you know. And um, yeah, man, a, a, a lot of men make fun of other men for for certain things and that they can't control, or they make fun of them because of this, that, and the other. Like that's men doing that to each other. A lot of men don't have each other's backs. I can't blame women for that. Because if you can let a woman manipulate you and then just and dictate what you do in life, you're not much of a man, are you? And that's what a lot of these dudes do. I can't, I can't blame somebody else when, even if a chick told me, you know, you shouldn't do this, you should do that. But if I do it and I pay and I and I pay the consequence, or you know, I have the consequence, that's my fault. And. I'm just saying, man. I, I, man, man, take responsibility for me too, man. Because that's a fact. Though, if a woman says, you know, if if men didn't exist, we wouldn't have the the, the crime and the and the and the and the, the, the violence that we have. That's a fact, and it's it's a sad fact. But I gotta admit that it's a fact. That's a fact. Men are too that goddamn violent. Mike there. Yeah, that's crazy in, in, in general, man. But a lot of men don't pay attention to stuff like this. So what they, 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 they wait till the woman has so much of an advantage. Mm -hmm. And it's too late. Yep. So I, 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 try, to, I try to run away when I see women. I feel like <laughs> they always have the right over the man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But see, but the problem is, is it's men who are giving them that power. That's and that's the problem. Ultimately, it's a, it ultimately it's some dude that has no stones that's uh, giving them. I mean, all the power. That's why I said, if simps like if if the purge happened. I remember this dude named Thomas Sotomayor said, he said that the purge happened. He said he's going after these men, not the women, the men. Because <laughs> that's facts, because the men are the ones who created these monsters. The, the, man, the man is the source of all these problems, to be honest, because they have conditioned the other side to do all this effery. Cause you there? 
Yeah. Yeah, she's no there. Alright, I'm not here. All right.
Mm-hmm. 